my beautiful daughters. It is with deep heart of joy. I welcome you to her presence today once again. Today we shall be performing two important rites. But first, we have among us the newly graduates. I want you to step forward and submit to Goddess Sierra the list of things you want from her. Now that you've graduated and are about to face the world. Rejoice, for your wishes have been granted. As long as you remain loyal to Goddess Sierra, you shall have it. As long as you wish it, you shall see the fulfillment of your wishes sooner than expected. Step forward. Your friends have recommended you highly. But I must ask, have you really made up your minds to be descendants of Goddess Sierra? To abide by her rules and laws? To partake of her endless blessings and forever remain in her bosom? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Yes, I do. Uh, Speak yourselves. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, Goddess Sierra. Good. Nancy? Serve them the drink. You have entered everlasting covenant with Goddess Sierra to abide by her rules and laws. Goddess Sierra protects and rewards her own. As long as you shall desire it, you shall have it. You shall be among the ruling class in your various campuses and the society at large. But as long as Goddess Sierra shall bless you, there is still her golden rules you must keep.
Thank you. No, you meant to your, your party. party. Thank you. <laughs> Just relax, rejoice, and have fun. Mm -hmm. Come on, don't be moody. <laughs> <laughs> we are fine, actually, but a bit nervous. Huh? Nervous? <laughs> Well, 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 I understand how you feel being a first timer, but I actually think you'll feel better if you can just follow me. Because we need to have some chit chat. Let's go outside. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Can someone tell us why you girls are nervous and not comfortable with our party? We are not just nervous. We are not comfortable with the whole thing. I mean, the rules. The, the uh, no, no, it's, uh, it's not about the rules, but some other thing that really scares. Something like what? Well, in my opinion, I think the fact that it says we can't get married to a man or bear children of our own, you know, or the, but we are allowed to adopt. Isn't that despicable? Is that not too much to ask? No, oh, don't say that. What do you need a man for when you have all the matters in life? And what's that, if I may ask? Money, fame, and, and power. power. <laughs> you think that's enough? No. Let's face the truth. This is Africa. You know how single women are regarded in the society. <laughs> Your power, money, fame, whatever means nothing when you don't have a man to call your husband. You lie, honey. Sweetheart, you lie. Let me tell you something about the society we live in today. Men are like dogs. Once a woman has these three things, which is fame, power, and money, they flock around you. Exactly. All you need to do is cook them, pick them up like noodles, spice it, slice it up, and the world goes round. Do you understand it? Now let's talk about people who matter in the society who are still single ladies. The Minister for Aviation, Minister for Petroleum, right? Or let's talk about the Minister for Information, the one we know as a senator now. Senator Miss Felicia Iro. I'm sure you guys know her. So tell me. Is she not a single lady? Are you serious? Senator Felicia Urobu. Oh, my, oh, my. She's my role model. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. Well, I'm um, sorry to bust your bubbles, honey. She is one of us. And don't worry, during the oh. end of the year annual get together party, oh. you will get to meet her. Oh, I can't wait to meet her. So, oh. why the complaints? You should even be grateful that our lady spiritual gave you lenient demands. Nothing goes for nothing. Or would you rather trade your own lives or that of your family to all this? Like they say, life is beautiful. <laughs> Enjoy it to the fullest. By the last honey. I'm telling you, come on, baby girls. Come on, let's hit the dance hall. <laughs> so let's go inside, baby girls. Ah, come on, girls. Come on. 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 You know they come back tonight. You, know back you tonight. say, say, so many champions to take. So many is your who to drop. So many who to do shine. So many money to spend. So many shisha to smoke. So many who want me to drop. So many shy to 
that look on your face. I mean, why are you surprised seeing me with a car? Mothers should rejoice when good things come into the family. You just graduated. And it's barely a year you left your service. How come this car? Or did you borrow to show off? No more surprise, borrow. Mama. Take a good look at me from head to toe. Do I look like someone who would borrow something? Mama, this car is mine. And to surprise you more, yours is coming. Come at the days when we lived in poverty. Mama, Maga, Patagi. Sister! Sister, welcome! Big girl. How are you? I'm fine. You're looking fine indeed. Thank you. Stop with that car. It's mine. Why are you and Mama acting as if getting a car is a big deal? Mama, you were the one that gave birth to your daughter and named her Hope. Does it mean names don't matter anymore? Hope for things to come. Hope for better things ahead. Mama, please, don't give me dirty your salmon now. I am not ready for it, please. Uh, you, you go. I have some things in the trunk, but you'll bring them later. For now, come and give me something to eat. I am very hungry. What did you cook? Mama, come inside. Please, I have more food. So 
Phones International. Doesn't mean I cannot open this door. Hmm. Hope, just respect yourself and leave this thing you know, before you spoil it now to say you have spoiled something. I've been having serious of bad dreams about you. And where they are showing me is not a place a child of God should be. You know how my dreams work? So please tell me, my child, are you into any group or cultism? I mean, even when you were in school. God forbid. God forbid I reject it for myself. Mama, these your dreams are very bad. And it's not about me. Please, please, stop having those dreams about me. Because I am very fine. The thing is that I got a job from an oil firm. And as the good Lord may have it, I got promoted to a higher level in the office. So, the dreams are not about me. I think it's familiar spirit. Do you still go to church? Mama, I am a pastor's daughter. That my father is late does not mean I should separate myself from the foundation he laid. See, in the church where I worship, I am a choir mistress. I am a prayer warrior. I am in the evangelical team. Hmm. We go for a soul outreach on a daily basis. Uh, Mama, look at me from head to toe. Forget this gown I'm wearing. I came directly from the office. Do I look like a worldly person? Hmm. I've not said that. But please be a child of God. Never forget that this life offers anything good as far as you're living in sin. Nem, come to Kenegu for a juju. Is buying a car a sin? I didn't say that either. But using evil money to buy a car is a sin and attracts death. But if your hands are clean and your money genuine, even the heavens will rejoice. Mama, can you please stop worrying about me? I am fine. The Lord is doing his wonders in my life. As you see me like this, Mama, I am grace personified. It is the grace of God that is working in my life. The only thing I need from you is your support. Pray for me always so that I will get promoted even to the highest level in the office. And make more money. Just keep praying for me. I shall be praying for you, my child. Pray. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pray without ceasing, Mama. Hmm. I'll be doing that. All this. Good morning. Good morning. This one you are glowing. Is it because of the new car your sister just bought? Yeah. <laughs> Have I not been glowing since? And my sister bought a car. Is it a bad thing? No, it's not a bad thing. But this one, all our girls are buying cars. And my sister has not even bought a car. Just... She is not a graduate now. When you go to school, graduate and get a good job. What is car, Kwan? Nancy has a very good car. Kate and even Amara of Iube community who works with the telecom company. So why should my sister's own be different? Very soon, I'll go to school and when I finish, I'll get a good job and buy a beautiful car. Hmm. It's easy for you to say. Not that you even have Waiek. School they don't agree you and you never have a right jam. Hey, 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 please. Are you not agree to this morning to start insulting me? Please. Ndala, don't worry, I'll surprise you. I 
Dugo, my dear. I summoned you at such short notice because there's a problem. It has come to my notice that one of my daughters is about to betray the sisterhood. She has supposed to betray her oath of allegiance to Goddess Sierra and opt out. The former is about to betray us and she must be stopped. What do I do, my goddess? You know exactly what to do. Let her pay the price of betrayal. I have handicapped her spiritually. Then you do the rest. Your last wish is my command. Go. Go, my daughter. Bia, huh? do you know that Elizabeth bought a car to you? Nah. Kendo, ba mo kuna ese. Eh? Chero, did you see the car with your two naked eyes? Kona koro ga koro. A sister has just confirmed. Just now, just now. Kendo, we are liabilities. Hmm. Huh? How can we sit and be talking? A girl will just bam out of out of this village and travel to the city. The next thing you will hear is that the girl has bought a car, and the girl will carry that car and pass in front of us. I want to call it now. It's high time that both of us will go to the city. When we reach to the city. We will hustle and make money because our mates are making money and buy cars. But wait, which our mates are you even talking about? Is it those ones doing yahoo yahoo in the city? It's not better. Yeah. It's not better. Can go is Akapamao. I will never be part of it. Yeah? Because even the international yahoo boy is now behind bars in America and nobody knows when he's coming out. Thank God you said international. In fact, international behind the bars. Okaramuma. I will stay here. Eh? It's better that you stay here because me, stay here. I'm going there. I'm not going to I'm going here. to make it. You can Anyhow. Can you not come to me here? You heard all I said. Be an example to others. A pastor's daughter should live an exemplary life. Hmm? And I would suggest, like I told you last night, to sell this car. Because men see women with wealth as non-wife material. And the most important thing in your life right now is to get married and have kids. Not a car. Mama, I, I will get a man that will marry me and introduce him to you. And the car? Do you want me to sell the car and be trekking to work? But is that what Mama is trying to say? Shut that? up! Look at this cockroach. Who asked you to speak? The woman by here. <laughs> Mama. If what you want, I mean, if what will make you happy is me selling this car, I promise you will not see it again. I will sell it. Hmm. Because the most important thing, my dear, is for you to get married. You know, ne? Uh huh. So I'm not tired, you. I will call you when I get you. My dear, Johnny Messis. Thank you, Mama. Messis. The Lord will protect you. Amen. Thank you, Ma. My dear. You need a physical too much. You need a chum chum chum. I'm not quite Come on, will you go and open the gates for me? I can't. I'm going to go. I'm going to go.
Hey, I wanna take your work of freedom. Hey, I wanna be free. Hey, I know do I get no. Freedom. Freedom. Oh. What is your problem? What is wrong with you? I've been calling you several times. You don't take my calls. You don't return my calls. Why are you avoiding everybody? What is your problem? I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light, the light of freedom. I wanna take your work of freedom. Leia, to be honest, I am fed up with you guys. Yes, I want out. What? Hold on. I hope what I've been hearing is not true. The rumor, I hope it's not true, right? You heard right. I am getting married to the man that I love. Girl, you're mad. You are going crazy, you are going nuts, you are stupid. No! I am not going mad, I am okay. I am just tired of this whole shit. <laughs> I am the only child of my parents. Henry engaged me. I am in love. I can't resist him any longer. Hey, hey girl, this, this, this route you are going through is too rough. You would not survive it. This is too dangerous. You will not survive it. You know, our mother's spirit will not go. Do this nonsense! She won't! What is wrong with you? Nay, nee, I don't mind. If this is the only way I will get myself free from this devilish fraternity, I don't mind! Let's see, listen. I don't want to lose you. I am scared of losing you. Please, don't you understand? I know. I don't want to die too. But you of all people should understand my plight. Yeah, I am tired. I wish I had known. I want my, I want to have gotten myself into this rubbish. Me, I am the only child of my parent. My father is dead. And my mother wants to see her. She wants to carry her grandchildren before she joins her ancestors. I love her so much. I cannot deny her this little favor. I am out of the sisterhood. I'm sorry. See, girl, I don't want to lose you. I am scared of losing you. I know. I'm sorry. See, we both know that you cannot escape our mother's precious anger. But do what you need to do to survive. And I would advise if you ask me that you just leave this town. Go away from here. And 
I wish you good luck. Thank you. I wanna take your work of freedom. 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 I wanna be free. Freedom. Freedom. I know to I get no. Freedom. freedom, freedom. Oh, it's been long. I am in darkness. I want my freedom. <laughs> You're still angry about what your sister said. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. As if you don't know your sister again. Uh -uh. Don't worry. See. She's going to be the first to call you when she can. Mm. Mama, what did I do wrong now? What did I do wrong? Is it a crime to talk in this house again? <laughs> no, it's not a crime. Seriously, it's not a crime. But she's your elder sister. So she has the right to shut you up. Eh? Don't worry. Eh? It's okay now. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda, my mind is troubled. <laughs> Don't tell me you are still regretting. I am. And I will spend the rest of my life regretting it. The truth is, I didn't know that the cult is this deadly. I thought it was just a male campus fraternity. Because I envied the likes of Matinda, Sophia, and I wanted to be like them. Me too. I, I was, I, I thought it was just a mere high school secret court. And that's why I wanted to join them. But girl, the deed has been done. There's nothing we can do. We can change it. Come to think of it, it's even better. I mean, our lives are now defined. We've been promised of a better future, of a brighter tomorrow. I mean, we don't have to worry about anything after our graduation. And that's what every girl wants. That's what every human being on earth wants. To live a luxurious life, have your own car, command money. I mean, you should rejoice, girl. Let's rejoice. Let's rejoice. Yes. Over what, Amanda? Over the fact that you cannot have a child of your own, let Lo get married. This is wrong, Amanda. Does it really matter? It does. At least to me. You don't know the joy I hope to get carrying my own child. Get married to the man I love and live happily. Amanda, what's the essence of this whole thing if you cannot get a family of your own? Please stop. Please. I know you wouldn't want to incur the wrath of Lady Spiritual upon yourself. Oh, please. Remember, we are new converts and our eyes are on us. Please, let's mind what we say or whatever we discuss. And please, let's end this conversation here. Please, let's go. 
Amanda. Let's go, please. This is. She declined. <laughs> Girls, is it not obvious that the rumor is true? There's no two ways about it. I'm pretty sure of this. If Oma is getting married to her longtime lover, Henry, she dares not. She dares not try that. I mean, that is her breaking her oath of allegiance to the goddess. That girl does not know where she's headed to. Um, Chinenye, hmm? if Oma is your best friend, why don't you talk to her? Talk to her? <laughs> talk to who exactly? I have been calling her for days now. She's not taking my calls. She's not even returning my calls. How will I talk to her? And she has moved out of the house. She, she has? has? Well, yes. She has moved out and then she would have known better than, I mean, hiding from her shadow. Nene, you honestly need to look for that girl. I mean, speak some senses into her. We are not ready to lose her yet, not now. Well, um, there is no need of you talking some sense into her main brain. It's a pity because I have gotten the spiritual order to get rid of her. The fact still remains that I'm going to get rid of her. It's an order and it must be followed. That's fine now.
Neye, how? Do you think that when I asked you to leave this country, is this what I meant? What is your problem? I asked you to leave this country as soon as possible. You know that if this people want to get you, they will get you and kill you. Don't you understand? What's your problem? Neye, I cannot leave this country. I will, but not until after my wedding. My fiancé is getting suspicious already when I moved house. Why are you being so stubborn? Why? See, you know I should not be doing this. It is risky. But I'm doing this because of the way you are to me. Let me tell you something, darling. Nancy has been assigned to kill you. And of course you know she will find you and kill you if you are still in this land. What's your problem? Leave your ass up. <laughs> oh, Nancy. They already made me spiritually invalid. If she wants to come for my life, let her come and get it. Huh. If, if I'm, I don't want to lose you. I don't want to lose you, please. Leave this country ASAP. After my wedding. Naya, after my wedding, please. Why are you be so stubborn? Why are you be so stupid? I want to take a work of freedom. Freedom, freedom. I wanna be free, freedom, free. Oh. Yeah, hello. Hi, beautiful. It's Michael. Sorry, Michael from where? Michael, the umbrella guy. Oh, the umbrella guy. Yes. You know, I've been. Anyway, Sam, thank you. Thanks to your umbrella and the gas. You know, I would have been beating so hard by doing. You are welcome. You're welcome. You, 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 you know I didn't get your name the other day. You know I'm Michael, but I, I don't know your name. Oh, well, you can call me Nancy. Nancy? Okay. So, Miss Nancy, I... I'm sorry, you did just call me Miss. And what gave you the impression that I'm a Miss? Well, I don't remember seeing a ring on your finger. Well, I guess you called for your umbrella, right? Uh, well, this call isn't about the umbrella, because that I can quickly replace. But the sight of you has refused to leave my mind. Your overwhelming beauty and your charm is something that I can seem to get off my chest. So I am calling tonight. Excuse me, pardon? Yes, I would like to see you again. But I'm, I'm not sure I know you. Have, have we met before? <laughs> Kate. Kate. Your younger sister's friend back then in secondary school. Kate Okafo. Kate. Kate. <laughs> Is this you? Yes, it's me. I mean. How I'm, are you? I'm good. How come you can't recognize me? Because you have changed totally. I mean, look at you. Gracious me. You look ah. absolutely beautiful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> 
I see I'm also put up weight in, 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 oh, in the right places. Eh? Thank you. <laughs> How have you been? Well, I've been good. So, what are you doing? Ah, uh, well, I run my own business. I am a businessman now. What? Yes, I own my own company. Really? Right. Oh, congrats there, congrats. Thank you so much, Kate. Goodness oh. me, it has been ages. <laughs> huh? can, can I have your number? Sure, 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 sure. <laughs> How's everyone at home? Oh, we are good. Ah, it has been ages. So nice to, to yeah. see you. Please do Same well game. to call me, eh? Sure, definitely. I'm calling you right away. It will be nice to reconnect. Oh, I'm calling you right away. <laughs> okay. uh, all right, I, I have my phone on the car, so but you, you call me and then we'll talk. Uh, okay. All right. You take care of you oh, now, you eh? Too. All right. Bye. Yeah, bye. <laughs> Take your work of freedom, freedom, freedom. I wanna be free, freedom, freedom. freedom. I know, do I get no freedom? freedom. I wanna be free. I need my freedom. freedom. It's been longer, I am in darkness. I want my freedom. <coughs> what is it? <coughs> what is the problem? Nothing. I I'm fine. But you don't look it. You're troubled. Okay. Is there by your husband to be? No, Mama, no way. We are fine. Everything is moving on well. Mama, go and sleep. We are okay. How can I sleep? How can I sleep when you are here? Sitting. You are awake. You are not sleeping. You are troubled. How? Mama. It's late. You shouldn't be up. Like I said, I am fine. Go to bed, please. Are you sure? Yes. Life for one, I want to be happy, I want to be free. So let me be, I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light, the light of freedom. Hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom. freedom, freedom. Hey,
will send you. I've been expecting you. Well, I am here. I have always been the execution of the years. Nancy. When do you think this will end? Hmm? As long as people like you don't stop a six in the system, it will never end. Nancy. Do you ever think that people will get so comfortable in this devilish confraternity and refuse to leave? Nancy, come on, think about it. This is not life. Nancy, please, please. We need to stop this. We need to stop this life so we can enjoy the beauty of what God has created. For Shut us. up! Shut the hell up! Now make a damn wish. I don't have all night. If I'm alright. Um, if I'm alright. Mama! Mama, I'm fine. Please, just go to bed. I'll see you in the morning. Please. Make your last wish. No! Nancy, please spare my mother's life. Yes. Thank you. Ah! Hey, Margaret. Margaret, please, please. Nancy, please, please don't kill her. Daughter, please. Don't kill her. Nancy, please. Don't get married in a few days, time. Please don't kill her. Please. Please, Nancy, please, I beg you. She doesn't deserve to die. Instead, kill me. My life. No, please spare my daughter's life. Please, I beg of you, kill me. Please, please, please I beg you. Oh, <laughs> kill me, Stan. Please, oh, just be my daughter. Fine. I'll let her go because of you. <laughs> yes! I didn't ask you to go. <laughs> So difficult to resist At the beginning is so enticing At the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night Scary day And your night will be full of nightmares You will not take me show of the next moment Hey If you know what will the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pain and glory. So where do I go now? Onye kange besala, de godi ni kamero mo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, onye kamya kosala, onye kange besala, ife mero mo. You see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing, but the end of it, you'll be in.
Um, hi, um, this is Kate. Yes, I know. How are you? Oh, I'm doing good. And I hope you're good too. So, where are you at the moment? I'm at home. Resting. Is everything okay? Yeah, all is well. It's just that I just want to ask. I don't know if it's possible we could just hook up tomorrow. Are you free? Oh, unfortunately, I'm not. I'm not free. I have things lined up for work tomorrow, so I, I, I can't see you tomorrow. Maybe some other time, huh? Um, okay, but. Uh, hi. Good night, huh? Yeah. Uh, oh, hello. My goddess, if I might stay, of course, I always trust you to deliver. Now, let me hear the request you wanted to make earlier. Um, it's of no importance. Never mind. I do go. I do go, my dear. You know you are the one so dear to me. You've been with me longer than any one of them. You have every right to ask me whatever you wish without hesitation. So go ahead and tell me what it is. Um, my goddess, it's nothing that I cannot do myself. Okay. If you say so, you may leave then. I think she deserves what she got. I mean, what was she thinking? That she could opt out just like that without being punished for it? Hell no. I never knew she could be such a fool. Of course you should trust our lady spiritual. She doesn't joke with things like this. Does she always bring Nancy to handle it? Yes, sweetheart. Nancy is the sisterhood's executioner. Really? Okay. Yes. Who did she succeed? That is what I cannot say. The only thing I know is that I came into the sisterhood to meet her as the one next to the lady superior. Um, and how long she has been in the picture, I I do not know. Okay. Me too. I would have never bothered to ask. Mm -hmm. Wow. She must have possessed a lot of power then. Yes, girl. And I kind of envy her. Mm -hmm. I do. Man, that girl is loaded. <laughs> hey, babes. Hi. Hey, hey baby girl. Yeah. Yeah. Only you that babe. I know, right? <laughs> What's up, babes? Come on, we've been waiting for you. What kept you so long? I'm sorry, I ran into traffic and then you maybe come here late. Uh, so I'm sorry. Yeah, now where are we clubbing tonight? Oh, that's the mm -hmm. spirit. Clubbing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you just say clubbing? Yes, clubbing. My dear, we are not clubbing, so you've not heard. If, if, I, if, I, if I heard, I would not ask you a question. We lost one of us. Who? Ifama was executed last night. Hey, sorry, I had to take some time to tidy up some things in the kitchen. So, what a one. What's going on? That's exactly what you get when you refuse to apply your aid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure some people don't want to share their hard and money with such cheap me. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> well, girls, um. Me? Huh? Are you okay? I mean, 
that reminds me, you called me yesterday night, right? You said you wanted to say something now. I, what is it? What's going on? No, no, no. Um, it's nothing. Uh, ah, I, 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 I have this severe headache. I, I need to go. Severe headache. What are you talking about? I can get you some, uh, um, some pills. I noticed her reaction when you said that Ifoma is dead. Do they have any special relationship or something? Yes, they do. Huh, the good. thing is that they have been friends with her Oh, I see. They are more than friends then. So much tears and so much pain. Ah, you see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. But at the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, a scary day. And your night will be full of nightmares. You will now take me show of the next moment. Hey, if you in your quenzel, with this if you will listen. Hey, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? Onye kange besala no, they go dini for me romamo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, onye kame ya kosala no, onye kange besala no, if I'm me romamo. Hey ya. You see, the gift of the devil is so flashy. So difficult to resist At the beginning it's so enticing But at the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night a scary day hey. And your night will be full of nightmares You are now taking show of the next moment hey. If you in your quince With this sip you will listen hey. The gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? Onye kange besala no, they go dini for me romamo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, onye kame ya kosala no, onye kange besala no, if I'm me romamo. Tears and so much pain. Ah, you see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing, but at the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey, if you in your quince, with this if you will listen. Hey, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? Onye kange besala no, they go dini for me romamo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, onye kame ya kosala no, onye kange besala no, if I'm me romamo. Hey ya.
You see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing, but at the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You will not be sure of the next moment. Hey. Why are you not taking my calls now? Come on. I mean no harm. I just want to be your friend. I want to get to know you. This is totally unnecessary. Hey, Kate. Howdy. Mama, please. Please stop crying. Take her, okay? How can How can I stop crying? She was my only child. She was all I had. Look at me, my children. I am a helpless widow. No husband, no child. What am I living for? Oh, no. Come on, don't talk like that. It's not the end of the world. It is for me, it is. If Oba was the only one that I was living for. Look at me, my children, just look at me. A wedding was supposed to be next week. She never wanted to die. She was begging the killer to spare her life. I knelt down and was begging this person to spare my daughter's life. I even asked her to take, to take me, to kill me in the place of hers. But she was heartless. God, you are watching. God, God, you are watching. Okay, just take heart. Eh? If you continue like this, you might you might just fall sick. You need to stop. Please. Um, Mama, please stop crying. Um, but tell me, did you see the person's face? I did not see her face. She was masked. She was masked. But what I can tell is. Why was it my daughter's life they wanted? Why? Why did you want my daughter's life? That is the only thing I cannot tell you people here. Yeah. She was innocent. If Mama was not the trouble type. Yes, Mama, you are right. She was our friend for years. <laughs> she was a peace-loving person. Mama. It's okay. It's okay. Look, I want to make you a promise. Whoever that is responsible for her death will never go unpunished. We are going to use all we have to make sure that her killers end up behind bars. Will that bring my daughter back to life, will it? It is useless! <laughs> no, at least she will have peace and justice. Whenever I see you, I think of my daughter in Mama. Will you be there for me? Will you? Yes, Mama, we will. Yes. I personally, I promise to always be there for you. I will be there for you anytime, any day. I promise you. Mm. Eh? <coughs> Just be hard. You see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. And your night will be full of nightmares. 
What do you want? Chine, please, I beg of you. I've been following you all this while so I can explain myself to you. Listen, you need to hear me at first. Shut up! Just shut your useless and bloody mouth up! You bloody liar! What do you understand? Huh? No, 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 I'm, I'm asking you. What do you understand? Do you understand the fact that someone loses a special person? Do you understand the pain of losing an only child? What do you understand? Which one? I'm asking you. Oh, oh, no. I should believe that you have a conscience, right? Do you? No, of course. Your conscience has been twisted to save the devil. For goodness sake, Chine. I was only carrying out instructions. I only carried out orders given to me to do. Yes. That's what I did. I, I can see it. Yes. Carry out instructions. Keep carrying out instructions. Keep taking orders. It is fine. I want you to put yourself in that woman's shoe. Did you see how when she was lamenting? Can you feel her pain? Put your mother in our shoes, then you will know where I am coming from. Keep taking orders until the conscience in you is finished. If at all you still have any conscience left in you, you bloody twat. Shh, just shut up. Chine, Chine, please, listen. It's not the way you say. Get out! Full of nightmares, you are now taking show of the next moment. Hey, if full on in the quince, what they see, Pia will see. Hey, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pain and worries. So, where do I go now? Oh, you can get better, they go to me for me. What I've done to myself, hey. Onye kamya kosa la no, onye kange besa la no. Ife melo mama, hey ya. You said it. Has any of you noticed that uh, Nancy has been behaving strangely lately? In how do you mean? She's no longer herself. She prefers to stay alone. Honestly, she's no longer the Nancy I used to know. Mm -mm. I think I agree with Funke. Mm -hmm. Nancy has totally changed. What could be the problem? Yes, I wonder. Maybe she's having emotional problems or family problems. As long as that life is expected. I mean, baby girls. This shouldn't be any of our problems. What we should be talking about right now is, Matilda, how are you planning this party? I hope it's going to be in grand style because I have invited a special friend. <laughs> really? So tell us about him. Who is he? Excuse me? I never said it's a he. But guess what? You got me there. Of course I know I got you. <laughs> okay, so... Tell us, come on, just at least tell us more about him, you know. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Well, he has been my crush for years. He's the elder brother to my friend back then in school. I have always been a secret admirer. And I think this is the right time to take what rightfully belongs to me. Since our friend here doesn't want to say anything, I think I should say. Do you know something? Mm -hmm. Of course you should know I know everything. Tell us. <laughs> well, his name is Michael. Mm -hmm. And I'm a boy. Did um, I ask you, Kate? Tell us, please. Come on, out with it. Why is she asking oh, this? Okay, okay, fine. Okay, I'm not him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, okay, fine. He's cute. Mm -hmm. He's tall. Mm -hmm. He's light in population. Uh huh. And guess what, Danica? What? He has masters in engineering. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and not only that. Yes, 
He is also a contractor and a businessman. Wow. 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 Is Girl, you're lucky, man. Mm. Trust me, I can't wait to meet this Mr. Special in person. Mm. Matilda, what did you just say? I... Please, please. I can't thread this one for anything. Mm -mm. I... If anybody near him matter, I feel by the person. No. I beg. I know fish here for this one as stingy. I beg. <laughs> Why your blood hot like this? Your man is our man. Uh, okay, okay, calm down, calm down. Which man? Um, the thing is that you should tell him to please come with his friends. Uh -huh. Because I am tired with that guy I am dealing with. I'm tired of that soup I am licking. I need someone more sexy. Mm -hmm. I need a guy with a six pack. Mm -hmm. wow. You know? Someone that will make me scream. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. So how are you? I'm okay. I, really, I'm sorry. I should have played traffic. Actually, we've been waiting for you. I know. But don't worry. <laughs> you miss anything? Right. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hi. Hi. Come on. Hello. How are you? Look at you. Oh, oh, oh. Take it easy. Take it easy. Hi, girls. Say hi to Michael. <laughs> Hello. It's really good to be here. <laughs> Thank you, thank you so much. I see you ladies are having fun already, eh? Your, your table is littered with all sorts of spirits. Nancy, how are you? I'm good. You look awesome yourself. It's really nice to see you again. Huh, thank you. Thank you. So girls. Um, Nancy, uh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry, ladies. I'm not trying to uh, take your friend away from you, but please, I'd like for us to just um, talk alone briefly, if that's if you don't mind. Please. I won't take much of your time, trust me. Yeah? Please make it snappy. Of course I will. Taking my calls. It's good to see you. Huh? But I'm sorry about that. So I was beginning to wonder if I had done something, you know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you weren't taking my calls. It just got me worried and thinking. <laughs> Kids, my smile, 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 smile. smile. Wow. <laughs> I mean, if I did something, you could tell me right now, I would apologize, straight well, up. you did nothing wrong, Michael. Okay. So why then have you not been taking my calls? I... Um, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, let me, let me, let me quickly attend to her. All right, I'll be, I'll be back. 
Oi, so make you call your mommy, tell her you know they come back tonight. You say, see, so many champions to talk, so many is your who to talk, so many who to do shy, so many money to spend, so many she shall to spend, so many who won't be to talk, so many shy or to shy. You are not living because tonight. If you do crack, crack, I go balance a move Tell me what you want, tell me what you need Say them no the joke, just tell me where to go Make me just the go Hey, tonight, tonight. you see tonight, tonight We go party tonight, oh. tonight. Hey, tonight, baby, tonight Oh, so sorry um. Sorry. No, I, I was about leaving. I, I, I know. I you outside. I know, I know, I know, I know. I, I'm, I'm here now. I'm sorry, please. Don't. So my friends are waiting for me. I, I don't even know what I'm doing here with you. We're talking. Come on. I'm sorry. Uh, if if you leave now, I don't know when next I get a chance to talk talk with you. I beg you, in the name of God, just give me a few more minutes, uh, please, please. I so make you call your mommy, tell them you know they come back tonight. So many champions to talk, so many is your who to talk, so many who to do shy, so many money to spend, so many she shall to smoke, so many who want me to talk, so many shy or to shy. You are not living because tonight, 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 tonight we go party tonight, we go party tonight. Hey, I said tonight, tonight, tonight we go party tonight. Somebody, baby, I go carry you go. If your guy come, I go manage a move. If you do crack, crack, I go balance a move. Tell me what you want, tell me what you need. Say them no, the joke, just tell me where to go. Make me just the go. Hey, tonight, tonight. you see tonight, tonight. we go party tonight. Oh. tonight. Hey, tonight. Oh, baby, tonight. tonight. Listen, Nancy, I like you. I really do like you. But it's almost as if something is troubling you. I, I, I don't know what it is, but it's in your eyes. I can see it. <laughs> Look, if there's a problem, I, can, I, I could help. I mean, I'm, I'm here. You can share with me. I'm willing to help you. I do not have any problem. And if at all I have one, Michael, trust me, he has no solution. Ah, no. <laughs> don't say that. Listen, there's no problem in this world without a solution. Okay? And, and don't, don't, don't begin, even if something is troubling you, don't worry about it. Worrying about it does not solve it, it just magnifies the problem. You know, it's, it's almost as if you're sitting on a chair that just rocks you back and forth. It's busy rocking you, but it takes you nowhere. But I can help you if you just share with me. Trust me. Okay? Oh, come on, Nancy. You can try. I'm afraid. I'm scared. What? Ah, no. Come on, don't do that to yourself. Uh, fear is the greatest enemy of man. Like I said, it makes the smallest things so big when you're afraid. You begin to think that the smallest of things is that big. I don't know what this problem is, but if you let me in, I am certain that I could help somehow please do you know what michael yes but done with this discussion thank you forget it you cannot help me okay, okay. get your hands off me i'm so my friends are waiting for me i need to go and meet I, them I, up i mean i don't even know what i'm doing here with you nancy hey come down come down come right? please no you can't okay you know what you know what okay we'll talk about this some other time I, I have something in my car I'd like to, to give to you as a gift. I don't want it. I won't be gone for a minute. Please. You really love it. Please. 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 
very much worried about uh, that, our daughter. What about her? Had she mentioned something about getting married or maybe presenting a f her fiancé to us? <laughs> that is really done by girls who want to build a family. Girls who want their parents to carry their grandchild. Not by our daughter Adugo. That is not in our agenda. Why is she like this? Why is she doing this? We brought her up well. And I believe she wants the best for us. That is what you think. A lot of things have changed. Maybe she's trying to punish us for something we know nothing about. Because why wouldn't she want to get married and give us grandchildren so that we can be happy? But the point is, I'm just waiting to, to know her intentions. Then I will pay her back in her own coin. Nay. Why are you talking like this? It has not gotten to this. 
I know she will, she will change her mind. She will definitely change her mind. See, I have said my own. Because she has no excuse why she's not married by now. No excuse. Man, Papa, I am in support of you. Yeah, eh? I I mean, my beautiful sister should have been married by now. Eh? She, she, she got all it takes. Or, or the beauty. The skin color. Or the shape. Call, ha, the money. No meeting. Eh? Oh, oh. Myself and my son. We're on the same page. Ah. <laughs> ah, Papa, ah, of course you know me. Ha, you know I don't support evil at all. Yeah, and I have made it clear to her that I will never, yeah, ukum naba will never visit her home again. Else she introduces her husband to be to us. You did? Ha! And <laughs> what was her response? She only smiled. But I meant every bit of my word. Nonsense. Uh, Papa, let me help you with this. Who told you? Hmm? Who told you? That I needed somebody to help me. Eh? Look at you. Where are you coming from? Where have you been all day? You've been running around with those your useless friends. When you finish running, you come home and start to and come and eat. Look, don't give him food this night. Don't serve him food this night. Hmm. Uh. Nah, nah, you want to use me and settle on this one? I'm on work room. Now, you people are discussing like son and father. The next minute, you are quarreling like devil and the beast. Akama Mandia, you people will not settle with me. You don't just involve me in this at all. Akama Adira, go dear, and What do you mean by that? Oh, you are the person supporting him. Okay, don't worry. I will deal with the two. Deal with him. He's your son. Deal with him. Don't worry, she will marry. Kate, let me get this. Are you telling me that Nancy left with Michael? Your Michael. Full care. Nancy left with Michael. Without my consent. Can you imagine? A friend that I invited to a party. And Nancy went behind me to, to snatch him away from me. Wait, I don't get it. What is their relationship? I don't know and I don't care to know. All I know is that I love Michael. And no one will stop me from loving him. Michael is my guy. I love him so much. And I'm not ready to lose him to any idiot, not even Nancy. Must it always be about Nancy all the time? Oh, come on, what is wrong with this girl? Just calm down, okay? Calm down. Michael is yours, and no one is going to take him away from you. No one. Why don't you tell her that? Because not even our lady spiritual can make me to give up on Michael. I want him, and I must have him out myself. I have tolerated enough nonsense. Calm down, calm down. Michael is yours, and you must have him all to yourself. Just chill, okay? Do we have you? Uh, sister, good afternoon. Good afternoon, sister. Wow, good afternoon. Someone remember to call me today. Aren't I lucky? <laughs> well, guess what? I will have to go for Thanksgiving for you remembering me at all. Ha! Uh, don't mention. Eh? Um, but, I, but I do call you now. You, what about you? Do you still remember us? It's you guy. Well, it's not my fault. You guys are the problem. Do you know why I don't come back home? Do you know? Uh, I'm sure you know the reason. <laughs> Do you know what? I have missed you so much. Why don't you come around one of these days? Yes, you can come over, you know. 
Ah. Hum. Hum, hum, hum. Hum, hum, hum. Sister, are you trying to tell me that very soon I will have a brother-in-law? Eh, where? Don't even start. Don't start. Ah, who is this lucky guy? Mamu Kuneze. Just get off my phone, please. Okay, fine. I've, I've heard you. I've heard you. Okay, bye. Eh. Bye. Okay, I'm going to bye. <laughs> ah. You never change. Ah, sister, you never change. Look at you. I'm sorry. Come on now. Don't be like that. I'm sorry. Sorry. Uh, traffic. You know this town. You uh, kept me waiting. I know and I'm sorry. Have you been here for so long? Well, for some time. You look gorgeous as always. Huh? I like the hair. Thank you. Uh, you were calling the waiter, right? Yes. Sir. Waiter? Please, eh? Good to Hi. see you again. Me too. So, I'm just all smiles looking at you. You know how I get when I'm with you. No. Get your phone and call your sister for me. Let me know if she is fine. Eh? I, I keep having these dreams. I don't know. Mama, these dreams do not end. Is it the same dream again? My dear, the dreams about Elizabeth shows that something is not right. So please call her. Eh? So that we can go and see the, dog, eh, the pastor. Biko. Mm, Mama, me, I doubt you should going to come. Oh. She's always giving excuses about her job. She's not having time. Go get your phone and call her for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. I could help you get that out if you let me. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You know that happened because you were not here. You were thinking of something. Mm? Yeah, you drifted off. What were you thinking about? Well, I wasn't thinking of anything. Are you sure? Yep. I should be asking you. What were you thinking of? Because I caught you staring at me. You really want to know? Mm -hmm. I was thinking about you. How you glow when you smile. <laughs> really, every time you smile, you glow, and I really do not think that you should allow room for anything to take a smile. Away. <laughs> How stunningly beautiful you are. You don't have to blush now, really. You know, honestly, I think that life is for the living, and I think you should give yourself every reason to smile every day. I could be your source of joy if you let me. Because really, I'd like to be in your life. <laughs> Nancy, you're stunningly beautiful. You're a head teller. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so there you have it. Now you know what I was thinking of. Yeah. But this tastes actually nice. Mm-hmm. I know I insisted on this flavor. You were a bit skeptical, but hey, you're liking it. 
Mm-hmm. Just nice. Yeah, um, hello, Michael. Hey, honey. I just want to say thank you so much for today. Thank you for putting a smile on my face. Trust me. I haven't had this um, lovely time with someone in a long time. Ah, uh, thank you too. Thank you for giving me the chance to make you happy. Huh? It was nice seeing you smile. It was nice. your beauty and if only you can do that I begin to ask myself what more would I need <laughs> well I will see what I can do I would appreciate the much that you can do yeah. Nancy I was just wondering if you and I can spend some time together I don't know why I tend to see it from a different angle. I think we should do something about it to put an end to all this. Please relax. What is it? Why are you being unnecessarily paranoid? Please. Will you shut up your dirty mouth, Elizabeth? Who are you? Who invited you? What do you even know? This was what you did that you made me to lose Tony to her. And now you want me to lose Michael to her again. That is not possible. And here you are opening your dirty mouth to, 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 to tell me to stop being paranoid. Wait, wait. What exactly is it? That's <sighs> alright. Who is Michael and who is it to you? Michael is my boyfriend. I love him so, so much. But Nancy is getting in between us. I want you girls to tell her to mark her limits because I'm not ready to lose Michael. Not even to anyone. And not even to you, Nancy. Okay, calm down, okay? Nancy, is this true? I mean... Excuse me. If I just keep my ass, is this true? He says... How you want me to hear when they speak bitch, you they mad? Something they bomb you. I no, you want me to answer your question before? I don't hear from night I beg. What did you Okay, fine. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Hmm. Is that so? So you want us to believe what you just said, right? That very day at the party, that guy left the venue with you and he never came back. So how do you expect us to believe what you just said now? No, now debate with they do. Ladies and gentlemen, no, now debate, no continue now. At the police station, you know, they interrogate me, Abby. All of them are they mad. Something they worry about head. What's mean of this nonsense? Listen, you either believe me or you leave it. I don't know what you guys are talking about. What is all this now? Now you have to worry about ask me say what I call you have with my thinking. Now wow. Oh, oh, oh okay. Okay. it's okay. It should better be the truth because I'm not ready for our path to cross together. Don't be shut up, Are you crazy? No, have you lost your sense of timing? You are not all right at all. What's the meaning of that? Listen, better watch your mouth because you are talking to Nancy else 
you will fix my rat. What's this? No, no, don't tell me to come to her bed. No, no, don't, 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 don't even go there. Were you not there? Were you not there when she said she be tolerating everybody? Make me run for you. Ah, uh, I beg. Ha! Please, guys, I'm going to do it. No! Calm down, calm down. Come out of here, please. You can't drink the gold. You can't drink the gold. Calm down, put your own and drink. Calm down, I beg. Ha, I can't just calm down. Not face me, not because. You know. <coughs> You've been awfully quiet. Is there something you want to say to me? Is everything okay? Yeah. You sure? I wanted to ask you. What do you have with Gates? Nothing. Why? Nothing, I just wanted to know. Nothing. Mm. She's my younger sister's friend. You know, they were cosmates in the university. So in their first year, I remember she used to come to our house a lot. Cut you my younger sister. Oh. And of course, all that time passed. I didn't see her again. And suddenly, I ran into each other at the supermarket a couple of weeks ago. We we're both excited, you know, given the fact that we're more like family friends. We exchanged phone numbers, and you know, since that once in a while she calls me, that's pretty much it. That's it. That's it. Mm hmm. That's it. I see. Funny. What's funny? Is there something I should know? No, nothing. Um, I just wanted to know. Okay. I know this might sound crazy to you, but I have fallen crazily in love with you, Nancy. Look, I am contented when I'm with you. I am the best of me when I'm with you. When I'm with you, I'm, I'm happy. I want nothing more in this life. And I have never felt that way with anyone else. So I know that what I feel for you is, is real and special. I... I don't have anything to say. I'd like for you to be my wife. <laughs> but you don't even know me. I don't need an entire lifetime to get to know you. What's important is that my heart has found you, Nancy. If you give me a chance, if you let me be your man, I promise to spend the rest of my life with you, getting to know you. I promise. Please. Be my wife. Please. Okay. Ah. It looks beautiful. See how pretty it sits on your finger. Can I kiss it? Sure. I 
I love you. I love you too. So that you called me out here? Yes, I did. I wanted us to talk about you yesterday because I think there was a mistake. I think we were in a rush, so um I wasn't drunk. I was certain, I was definite with everything that I said. Nancy, I want you. I want you. I wasn't drunk. I really want you in my life forever. Listen, you can't be beside me. Why? It's risky. You don't even know me. Whatever comes with me. I can't see my life without you in it. Come on, baby, please. Alright, if we have love for each other, we will conquer. We will only conquer if we survive it. What I'm trying to say is that we might lose our lives in the process. It, it just, it's not worth it. You just have to get someone else or look. I don't know how to put it, but. You know, man's greatest enemy? Fear. I don't know what this fear is about. I will be with you every step of the way. All I ask is that you love me like you should. And we'll be fine. Baby. It's not about fear, I take away that which you have in your hands. Do not allow confusion steal your heart. Too, but I cannot but stand seeing you hurt. I... I'm not gonna be hurt as long as you agree to stay with me for the rest of my life. Why are you so stubborn? Love is stubborn. Right? <laughs> you see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. That's my daughter. Now you're talking. You are beginning to act like the true child of your father. Papa, you should know that I will always represent you. I will always be my father's daughter. Besides, I will always do things that will make you be proud of me. You almost disappointed me. Nevertheless, it's not too late to begin to reflect the daughter I've always been proud of. Hmm. Ada, you said you represent your father very well. What about me? Jealousy. I'm an alien, right? Mama, don't even start. <laughs> when I said I represented Papa, does not mean you're out of it. It means you contributed 50% while Papa contributed 50% just to produce me. So I have to make you guys happy. I mean, I have to make you guys be proud of me. You are right, dear. I'm very, very happy for you, my daughter. I know you will never ever disappoint us. That all this while you are just waiting for the right man to come. And now here he is. Exactly, my daughter. The only disappointment we have in this house is Uzochi. Okay. He's a huge headache to me. Mm -hmm. That reminds me, Papa. Where is he? I've not seen him since I came. That fool. It's not possible for him to be in this house by this hour of the day. He's either gone hunting with those his useless friends, or they are somewhere around the village making one trouble or the other. In fact, I have made up my mind that... Uh, no, what are you saying, Papa? No matter what you say, he is still your son and... Ah! Come and see! Look at you! Sister! <laughs> oh, come here. How are you, my baby? I have missed you, you know. I missed you. Wow! But you! You look so big. Where have you been? I mean, I've been here for a long time. Uh, I went... Uh, when did you arrive? Uh, not quite long. Eh? You look good. You too. Where are you coming from? The only thing that will cause problem between you and I is when you call this one that is an old man, old enough to get married. You now call him baby. No wonder he's still behaving like a kid. He 
it is you and the mother that is spoiling him. <laughs> no, please don't mind your father. He is only jealous. We have good news for you. Guess what? Your sister has just been engaged. That's your child. Ah. Hey! Ah. Oh, hey! 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 Puff! Le le no! Le we no ring! Hey, sister! Now you are talking. Eh? Get back here, Bian. Now I can freely come and visit you anytime. Eh? Uh -huh. I can even leave this village safe and come and stay with you. Hey, better. Mm -hmm. I can't even wait. I mean, I'll be the happiest. Yeah. <laughs> what are you both talking about? You are going where? Who is going to help us with farm work? Eh? Ese, did I hear you say that? Hey, we are you not the one that was complaining that he is useless? Eh? So you have already started missing him when he has not even traveled. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, a scary day. Hey, and your night will be full of nightmares. You will now take me show of the next moment. Hey, if you in your pencil, what this is, will listen. Hey, the gift of the devil. It comes with so much pain and worries. So where do I go? You know, I I have come to realize that we humans we constitute I mean we contribute to 90% of the problem we face every day. This same problem that kills us. The decision we make as humans either make us destroy us or curse us and then I have also come to realize that there is no problem that does not have a solution just like my friend always say I guess you're right you know some call this decision betrayal while I call it a walk to freedom. I think whatever decision you make when it comes to your freedom is just a fact. Or don't you think so? Nancy, how can you be asking such a question? There is nothing as sweet as freedom. You see, and I'm right there. But you speak more in riddles. Why are you saying all this? <laughs> Never mind. Just drink up. You'll get to find out soon. Come on, Kate. What are you talking about? Michael cannot say such a thing. What are you intimating? That I made this up? Listen, I know you're the closest person to Nancy, but the truth is that you don't know anything about her. Wait a minute. Are you saying you believe what Michael told you? Of course. Why wouldn't I believe him? Can you please give me a good reason you should? Oh, the reason is very simple. Nancy is not to be trusted. She is not what you people think she is. I... I, so, something in me tells me that one day she would betray this sisterhood and here it is. Oh, please, come on, Kate. Can you stop saying that? If you can believe this crap, that means you can just believe anything on, and everything you see or you hear. You should not believe such things. I mean, why are you girls finding it so difficult to believe me? Because we all know Nancy. Ah, second come on. We all know Nancy. She will not dare. What am I saying? She cannot try it. She can't even think about it. Not that claim my friend for her. For such similar issues, they're not going away. She can't try it. She don't fit one. Ah. Of course not. Huh. Lizzie, did she mention such to you, you know? The thing is that we were together last night, but she did not mention anything of such. Then what are we not saying? Mm -hmm. Eh? The young man is just trying to make irrelevant excuse to scare you away, Kate. Wake up from your slumber. 
Sorry to bust you guys' bubbles. The truth is, um, Katia is right. Michael is right as well. We are engaged. Getting married soon and no one. I mean, no one is stopping us. Kate, my dear, you don't know what you're talking about. It cannot be my own Adogo. My lady, this is not rumor. She even confirmed it herself. But if you doubt me, you can invite her over and ask her yourself. There is no need wasting time on such nonsense. The Adugo that I know cannot do such. But my lady, why don't you... Enough! You may leave them. Oh, here she is. You can ask her yourself. Adugo. You cannot believe what Kate was telling me. And what she told you is nothing but the truth. I am taking a walk of freedom. I have served you long enough. I have found love. And I want to move on with my new life. Is that too much to ask for? Nancy, you are very funny. You already know that what you are asking is impossible. Will you shut your trap? I wasn't even talking to you in the first place. Nancy. I do not know who has corrupted your mind. But you must understand that your loyalty lies here. Well, my loyalty with you ended long time ago. What is this? Am I your slave? No, tell me, am I in a cage? Well, I am not begging you to give me my freedom. I am taking it because I deserve it. <laughs> and if any one of you tries stopping me, I will crush you. Stay away from me. I am taking my walk of freedom, and that is final. I want to end this question which every Dick and Harry keeps asking me. And what is this question, if I may ask? How is your husband? How is your family? What about the kids? I'm taking a walk of freedom. How did you get in here, Kate? So it's true you want to marry Nancy? Yeah. I said that to you already. Why would you think that I would joke with a thing like that? You must be a joker. I advise you to put a stop to that your plans. Why? You need to cancel that marriage plans. You don't even know anything about Nancy. But if you want to go ahead, try it. 
Merci. You requested to see me. Um. So urgently, I, I mean, that has ever happened before. I don't know. I don't know what to ex expect. But are you are you okay? Is everything fine? Yeah, everything is fine. I I was missing, so I wanted to see. Are you okay? I should be asking you if you if you're fine. You have never said this. You have never been this way with me before. Is everything okay? You know, Michael, um, what I'm about to say is so hard for me because this is the first time I'm feeling this way. And I know I'm about to take a huge risk, but I just have to say it. I, I just want you to know that I love you. I love you so much. Like, I've fallen deeply in love with you and there's nothing I can do about it. And I just want you to promise me that you will always be there for me. I want you to promise me that you will always have my back. No matter what, that, that's all. That's all I need to hear. That's not all. You know that I want you as much as you want me, if not more. So I promise you here and now, but I'll always have your back. I'll never forsake you. I'll never let go of this hand. Because I love you too. I'll be with you. Every step of the way. Until forever. Thank you. Thank you too, baby. <laughs> Can I at least hug you? <laughs> I know. <laughs> so, yeah, that was right. <laughs> Drugo, my dear, stop being naive and come back to where you belong. I do not belong there anymore. Is that too hard for you to understand? Adugo, you know the consequences of what you're about to do. And I wouldn't want to have it to my conscience should anything bad happen to you. Wait, wait, wait. Did I just hear you say conscience? No, make me to understand. Does it ever have a conscience? I doubt. Because if you do have a conscience, you will let me go. What else do you want from me? I have served you long enough. Let me be, let me have my freedom. How is that asking for too much? How? My orders do not include exchanging words with you. I've only brought you a message from the most powerful, Goddess Sierra. You have 48 hours to repent and come back to the sisterhood or expect the worst. Whatever she calls herself. I, Nancy, will never fall for such empty threats. I won't. 
I am done with you. <laughs> Listen, just let me be. I have nothing to do with you. Not anymore. It's a matter of fact. To hell with you. Go to hell. My mind is made up. To hell with you. I sleep me alone. Nancy must be such a big fool to ever think she would escape this. I will do everything within my powers. I will hurt her down with the last drop of my blood. But she will never escape this. Exactly. <laughs> At least for my friend, my dear friend, the former who was killed unjustly, I would not let this one slide. Nancy will pay with everything in her. I will not let that injustice go scot free. I will make sure she goes down. I do not care if my life goes down with the life. I don't care. She will pay and she will go down with it. That's the promise. Exactly. But I wonder why our lady spiritual is yet to do something about it. What could she be waiting for? That's, that is the sad question I'm asking. Why? Why is she not doing anything about it? You know, if it were to be somebody else, Oh, Nancy, go and kill this person, and then she'll go boom and kill the person. Why is that all not happening so? Like, I don't understand it. I don't care. I do not care. Nancy is going down on this one. She is going down, and that is it, 100%. I will personally see to it. Just watch and see. <laughs> oh. Oh, now I see. Now I see why she's not doing anything about it. Oh, I think it's because somehow Nancy is dead to her, right? But I do not care. Yemwa, do not care because I'm going to take laws into my hands. And that is it. That girl, that snitch, we go down for this one. Simple. Do you know what I have in mind? Just relax. Just relax. Action speaks louder than words. Adugo has rebelled against the sisterhood. And she has exceeded the time frame of grace I gave her. Kate. Yes, my lady. I want you to get rid of her and take over her position. Yes, my lady. Do that without further delay and report back to me. Yes, my lady. She has high volume power I gave her. But you will see how she will end up by the time the power leaves her body. The fight has just begun. You may leave now. Who are you? Show yourself and stop acting childish. Who the hell are you? Oh, it's you. So you are the one she sent. And guess what? I'm assuming your position after I must have killed you. <laughs> okay, you are assuming my position. Well, congratulations on your promotion, girl. But guess what? You cannot kill me. Do you know why? I go. What I go? I'm okay. You cannot kill me. Don't mess with me. You have some power in you. I'm sorry to disappoint you because you've been handicapped spiritually. It's only shaft that is left. 
<laughs> oh, this is funny. Fine. You came to destroy me, right? You wanna shoot? Be my guest. I want you to make a last wish. I've got no last wish, Kate. If you wanna shoot, you shoot, you don't talk. Haven't you heard of such before? Then you leave me with no choice. Oh, you know, there's one thing you always forget. I, 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 I can't fathom to understand the fact that you should know that I've been in this fraternity before you. I was there even before you were initiated. Let me tell you something. Spiritually, mentally, physically, I am good to go. You cannot kill me. Not even your goddess can penetrate me. Do you understand that? Do not think you've won. I will be back. I will stop at nothing until you're dead. Let me ask you a question. Why are you so bent on killing me? This, what have I ever done to you? Why do you want to kill me at all cost? Why do you ask me such questions, Nancy? Do you want to pretend like you don't know? You inducted me into this deathless fraternity. And now you want to opt out and have a happy life. Do you think I'm happy here? Do you think I don't want to get married and have my own family? I think that is not enough. You're getting married to the only man, the only man I've ever loved. You will never go unpunished. You've taken virtually everything from me. I will do everything within my powers to make sure I kill you. That I promise you. I wanna be free. Freedom, free. Hey. I know do I get no I wanna be free. My freedom, freedom, freedom. Oh, it's been long. I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light, the light of freedom, hey, I want it. Bombay, you are gonna have a sleepless night. Scary day, hey. and your night will be full of nightmares. You will now take me show of the next moment. Hey, if you look in your quince, what this epia will see. Hey, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pain and worry. I don't know, man. I, I, I feel my house is haunted. Haunted? What are you talking about? Look, I, I know what I'm saying, all right? The, the, there's this airy feeling tonight. I, 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 see, I see my house is being haunted by ghosts. Ghosts? I'm serious. I mean, look at me now. I, I, I clearly ran out of the house to, to be here. I'm, I'm running to a friend's place seeing if I can pass the night there, and, I, and I ran into you. Look, I am serious. Listen to me. Listen. If this is a joke, cut it off. I mean, you and I know that ghosts do not exist. Don't you in 16 movies? Sweetheart, can you trust me? 
I know what I saw. It was terrifying. It was as if I was going to die. I was scared for my life. Objects were moving. Things I could I could feel things around the house. I know what I'm saying. It was terrifying. Now. That's why you left your house. Look. I am not going back to that house, all right? I'm, I'm going to call a real estate agent tomorrow and move out of that. The house is haunted. <laughs> no, sorry, I'm not laughing, but... You're laughing? No, I'm, I'm not sorry, but... There's no way you leave your house just because you, you're having some childish violations. No! It is. What I saw, what I saw was not in my head. Like, it happened real, like, no imagination. Fact, like, it was happening. Objects were moving, my, my cutting was... Like the lights were blinking. I, 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 I didn't know what was happening. I ran out of it. Okay, Look okay. at me. You don't call it imagining. I, I, I'm not I've, imagining things. I've heard you. But trust me, sweetheart. No matter what, it shouldn't scare you to leave your house. Are you trying to say that my husband to be cannot even save me in time of danger? Is that what you're trying to say? Come on now. You're a man, man or... yeah. Okay, fine. I'll, I'll, I'll drop you off. Let's go. I'm scared, man. What do you want? I want you to take Michael, my fiancé, out of this. He has nothing to do with this and you know it. What do you mean by he has nothing to do with this? He betrayed me! Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You're wrong. He did not betray you. In fact, at this point, I am sure that you know nothing about betrayal. First of all, this guy never, I mean, promised you anything, or did he? Secondly, he never took advantage of you. So how then can you boldly tell me that he he, he, he he betrayed you? I think you were just unnecessarily jealous. Trust me, Kate. Jealous? Nancy. Me jealous? Listen. I know I brought you to this. And sincerely from the bottom of my heart, I am sorry. But you can still have your freedom back. All you need to do is to take a walk with me. That's all. It's too late. It's freaking too late! Just take a good look at you. You can't even save yourself, let alone saving me. <laughs> One thing is going to solve this, and that is your death. I must see to it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Kate, it's not even in your wildest dreams. You cannot kill me, honey. You can't. But I'm here to send something very clear to you. A drop of Michael's blood. A touch on him. And I will end your generation. I will destroy you. Damn it. You see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, a scary day. And your night will be full of nightmares. You will not even show of the next moment. Hey, she said this to you? Yes, my lady. I guess we underestimated her. Of course, we did. Not to worry. I will take it off from here. Yes, babe. I I mean, I, I told my parents. Yes, I told them we'll be coming over the weekend to see them. And they're really expecting us. What? What are you saying? Come off it, babe. Anything you have. Anything we have, we can give them and they are fine with it. This is my house. You can't bother me about it. You know how much I hate light. I know how much you hate light, and that is why I'm not going to turn it off. 
because I have nothing to do with darkness. And Nancy, that darkness is where you belong. You cannot deny it. You lie. That was a long time ago. Not anymore. I have decided to accept light into my life. What are you doing here? You have no idea what you're up against, young lady. <clears throat> you think so? Well, I am fully aware. Guess what again? I am ready to give it to you hot, hot. Do you understand me? I will fight you with every bit of my strength. You cannot withstand my destructive force. I will destroy you. I dare you. I dare you, Goddess Viana. Shut up! It's fine, eh? It's fine. But first, you have to change that your clicker canvas that you wear to every occasion. Come, you better don't insult me. If you want to go for the wedding alone, then go. You don't have to remind me by calling my canvas or clicker. Do you know how much I bought it? How much how much did you did you buy it? Eh? How much did you buy it? Come, you have to be careful of yourself. What is this? What is it? Nothing. We are just discussing about um, Nancy's wedding on Saturday. That is what we are talking about. Yes, Uzo. Your mother brought the invitation to our house. I'll follow my mother and come. Follow who? Yeah, follow who and come? Eh? You think it's all that village wedding that they do at the village under the mango tree? Ah, uh -uh. meaning what now? Meaning that before you come for my sister's wedding, first you have to make a very nice hair. Yes. Secondly, wear a nice shoe. Thirdly. Wear your Christmas clothes and come. And now, yeah, one nice perfume. <laughs> yeah, spray nice perfume. Put your hand now. So, Uzo, you are now the one telling people what to wear to your sister's wedding, okay? Before, it's my sister's <laughs> wedding. So, and you know, my brother in law is a big boy. So, I don't want him to see my friends as, as you guys. So, you have to dress very well. Eh? Well, well, I can see that you want to eat everything in the wedding. Well, go alone. I'm not coming. Me too. Me too. I'm not going. Eat your sister's wedding. Carry it on your head. Yes, I'll cut on my head. What? Don't come for my sister's wedding. All I'm saying is that before you will come for my sister's wedding, you must wear nice clothes. Else, mm, Makachi, Minera, you will not see. Oh, our work has asked me. Mama will ask me that day. Don't worry. Work has asked me. I will be the one to share the food at the wedding. Share the food and I'll yes. call it from your hand. You, you can't. I'll collect it. You can't. I'll collect it. You can't. Eh. Uh -huh. Ekine. If you see the money my brother-in-law sent to my dad to get new, uh, new shoes and new clothes, nah, that man went and buy rubbish. That man is so classless, eh? So classless. But wait, too. does it mean so, your in-law gave you money to buy yours too? No, my sister did. Oh, okay. Uh, she sent me 50,000 naira to get nice shoes and nice clothes. So have you bought them? Ah, yes, now since I went to AGK's boutique, Okay. Yes, I settled down there. Yeah, I selected nice, nice shoes. I bought that Adidas and uh, Louis Vuitton. That one that used to bring light and nice clothes. Ha! Let's go to my house. I'll show you. So how much did you buy the Louis Vuitton? Uh, thirty-five. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Louis Vuitton. Ah, look. Okay, let's go to my house. Let me Come show on, you. let's go. Let me, let go me show you the clothes. That's what I keep. That's what I, that's what I, that's what I keep telling you about that your worn-out shoes, eh? I wanna be a free, freedom, free day. I know, do I get no freedom? I wanna be free. I need my freedom. Oh, it's been long, I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. Now.
There are some spiritual angles attached to what happened in day. Oh yeah, clearly. Oh yes, of course. Clearly. And I need to know, what do you know about what happened in there? Look, I want you to tell me everything. Alright, I've been watching you closely and trust me, there are some strange things about you. So tell me everything you know about what happened there. I, I want to know, really. I used to be a member of a female court. What, you, you what? A deadly one at that. It all started the very first day I got into school. But your, your first year in college? Yes. I was so loyal. I grew so fast. I was made the second in command and also the executioner. But we had a policy. No one should have a child of their own get married or even try to leave. Anyone who dares dies immediately. The truth is that the head of the court has power to do anything and to execute anyone who is. I was so happy. I was so comfortable not until you came into my life. Everything changed. Mm. I see. <laughs> so uh, this strange things. So, uh, 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 what about this? You know the strange things that I I I I I I, 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 see, I see around here. What is it about? The court has great powers to do whatever they want. Even the one I still have in me, still there. I have warned them severely to leave for Ceylon. I keep, I mean, I've been defeated them. I don't know why they decided to come back again. I don't know why they're back. So what, what are we going to do? So 
difficult to resist At the beginning it's so enticing but At the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night Scary day And your night will be full of nightmares You are now taking show of the next moment Hey if you know the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? Onye kange besala no, they go deni for me rumwe mo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, onye kamya kosala no. Onye kange besala no, ife melo mo. You see the gift of the devil is so flashy So difficult to resist At the beginning it's so enticing But at the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night Scary day hey. And your night will be full of nightmares You are now taking show of the next moment hey. If you look at the the gift of the devil it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? When I can get my soul and they go to me for my room and more. Look what I've done to myself. When I can get my soul and when I can get my soul and more, if I'm alone. So much tears and so much pain. Oh, you see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing, but at the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleep. I don't understand what you're saying. What I am saying is what is going on. I am telling you what is happening. I have been to the police, I have made reports, and they keep telling me they have nothing. They have nothing. Something is definitely wrong, and I will get to the root of it. To think that my wife is pregnant. My wife is going through all of this, carrying our child. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll see one or two persons. And we shall know where to start the search. But, but you know, I can, I can come with you. you. You need me to... to... No, 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 no. You just do yours, and I'll do mine. Is that okay? Well, thank you. All right. Let me be on my way. Thank you. I want to be free. Freedom. Free. Hey. I know do I get no freedom, freedom. I wanna be free hey. I need my freedom, freedom. Oh. It's been long I am in darkness I want my freedom This is not the life I want I want to be happy I want to be free so let me be I don't need you anymore No more darkness I have seen the light The light of freedom hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom hey, I wanna be free Freedom Freedom I know do I get no freedom, freedom. I wanna be free hey, I need 
need my freedom. freedom. Oh, it's been long I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness. I have seen the light. Uh, Madam, no go pay my money. Madam, work of freedom. 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 I wanna be free. Freedom. freedom. So much tears and so much pain. Oh, you see the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning is so enticing, but at the end of it you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey. If only you went to with this if you will see the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So, where do I go now? Oh, you can get better than what they got in the family. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, oh, you can get better than what. Onye kange besa la noi ife melo mamo eya you see the gift of the devil is so flashy so difficult to resist at the beginning is so enticing but the end of it you'll be in bondage you are gonna have a sleepless night scary day hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey, if only you knew when to wait to see if you will see. Hey, the gift of the devil. It comes with so much pain and worry. So where do I go now? Sister, thank you. Sister, where is your car now? Were you not here when Mama asked me to sell them? And I wanted to counter it, but you shut me up. Small madam. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. You know I was very angry that day. Mm -hmm. And you also know how Mama is with her preaching. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Don't be angry. Yeah, I've heard you. Please, Mama. She went to see Godia. I don't know what they are talking about, uh, Nancy. Nancy. Mazi because of that, the one you guys went to the same school. <laughs> what story are they talking about? Me, I don't know. I'm a Malcolm, she'll be the one to explain. Me, I don't know. I'm to say. So much tears and so much pain. Oh, you see, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey, if only you knew when to wait to see if you will see. Hey, the gift of the devil. It comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now? Only can get better than what they got in the family. What I've done to myself. Hey, only come ya go salon. Only can get better than what if a mellow. Hey, 
You see the gift of the devil is so flashy So difficult to resist At the beginning it's so enticing At the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night Scary day And your night will be full of nightmares You are not even show of the next moment Hey if you see the gift of the devil it comes with so much pains and worries so where do i go now look what i've done to myself hey onye so enticing at the end of it you'll be in bondage you are gonna have a sleepless night scary day hey. Your night will be full of nightmares. You will not even show of the next moment. Hey, if you in your pencil, what this sepia will see. Hey, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So, where do I go now? Oh, they can't get better. They go in for me. What I've done to myself Hey Onye kam ya kosala noy Onye kam ya kosala noy If a melo mama Mama Does it mean you don't see each other in the city? Ever since we graduated I've not set my eyes on Nancy Yes I know we live in the same city But with the kind of fuck I do Mama I am so occupied that I don't even have time for myself. So, she is missing? That is what her mother told me. But I believe they will see her. I think something is wrong in her marriage. Uh, but come on, you don't attend her wedding. I didn't see Kate either. Who is Kate? Uh, get your schoolmates from this village too. Mama, I don't remember who the kid is. About Nancy, she did not invite me to her wedding. So I didn't bother myself coming. And another thing is that she doesn't ask of me. Someone can no longer when you go hippie you went. After all, nobody is feeding each other. We are all from the same village. Hmm? And should be looking after each other. Huh. Mama, mm -hmm. I I will be traveling back tomorrow morning. Okay. I thought I should come and check on you to see how you're faring. Like I can see my mother is glowing. <laughs> you're looking fine. Oh, I'm glad it's a good. Yes, and there is this program we are having in church. It's starting tomorrow. I don't want to miss it for anything. God should interest you the most. Yes, so. oh, and give God praying for a good man. Amen. God will do it. Amen. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Mama. Mm. Thank you. God will give me a good man. Yes. <laughs> he will do it all. Amen. I believe you. <laughs>
What a world. What type of oh, what type of life is this? What type of suffering is this? How can my daughter be missing? How? My enemies have finally got into me. If only my husband had listened to me. If only. I told him. And I warned him. I told him how dangerous his brother is. But he would not listen to me. Who am I that he would listen? And today. Now. My daughter is missing. And she is pregnant. Hey! Can you can get me? Bia, Bia. Papa, Mama is right. Yes, so. You see what happened to Sister Nancy? Eh? We need to look into it. Yeah, I could see no child, no child. Yeah, no me, yeah, no me. Eh? My daughter, where? At Peter Willing Junction. She was jumping up and down, dancing as if she is raving mad. Hey. My daughter. Let us go and bring her back. Wait. She did not even recognize me. Who where did you say? Sir? I saw her. Go and get my Peter phone. Well Let me call my girl. Hey! If you see my her. My daughter, a man! Behaving like a mad person! Jumping and dancing hey. as if she's raving mad. Who said it? Bring my phone! Oh, Take your work of freedom, freedom, free. I wanna be free, freedom, free. I know, do I get no freedom? I wanna be free. I need my freedom. It's been long, I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy, I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light. The light of freedom. I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, free. I wanna be free. Freedom, free. I know, do I get no freedom? I wanna be free. I need my freedom. It's been long, I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy, I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light. The light of freedom. I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, freedom. I wanna be free. Freedom, freedom. I know, do I get no freedom? I wanna be free. I need my freedom. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I wanna be free. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I know, do I get no? Freedom, freedom. I 
wanna be free. Hey, I need my freedom. Oh, it's been long. I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness. I have seen the light. The light of freedom. Hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I wanna be free. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I know do again. No, freedom, freedom. I wanna be free. My freedom, freedom, freedom. Oh, it's been long. I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness. I have seen the light, the light of freedom. Hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I wanna be free. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I know do I get no? Freedom, freedom. I wanna be free. I need my freedom. freedom, Um, the baby, the baby is kicking. Um, just that her temperature is not too good. We can stable it and run more text on her. Mr. Michael, see me in my office. It's okay. It's so bad. Mm. No problem. I know my enemies has gotten me, but there is no problem. My God, I know my God, the God I serve. He will pay them back one after the other. Let me go and prepare. I'll go and see them in the hospital. Oh, God, dear. You need to be calm. The doctor has assured us that she's very fine and the baby is in good condition. Yes. Um, what is the name of the hospital and how do I locate it? Uh, your in-law knows uh, the hospital. Uh, I suggest you tell Uzochi to call him so that he will tell you how to locate the place. Hey, Frankie, how far? <laughs> oh boy, guess what? My wife just put to bed, man. <laughs> yeah, she just got bed. 
Oh boy, what do you expect? Of course, I'm excited. <laughs> boy, bouncing baby boy, bro. <laughs> what did you say? Oh God, relax. I'm no longer in your league anymore, man. <laughs> I'm a father now. Call me daddy. <laughs> yes, of course, we'll celebrate. Not a problem at all, not a problem. I'll let her know you send your regards. <laughs> ah, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm driving around, running around, so I'll call you. <laughs> yeah, bye Frankie, bye. <laughs> ah. Fine. Thank you. <laughs> Leave me be impressed now. I'm tired. Oh. Well, I think he's feeling sleepy. Mm. To sleep. Hey, honey. <laughs> <laughs> How's baby doing? Fine. <laughs> I'm so happy. Me too. Please, I do not want exclusive. I want my child to take water when necessary. Of course, so, eh? what? But what? But exclusive is very good to babies. At least for six months. Eh? Yes. Is that so sweet? Has said something? Mm -hmm. uh, um, no, it's just um, ignore him. Maybe yeah. we need to get going with this charge since the morning. Yeah, that's true, nurse. Uh, thanks for your help, but uh, my sheet now. Thanks to read him of the secret court on the street. You made people call me mad woman. You took away my senses. Why? Tell me, why are you so mean? What do you want from me? Now you want to break my marriage. You want to destroy my marriage. Listen. If you ever touch even a strand of my son's hair, I will do the unimaginable. I'm not joking. <laughs> what do you want from me? Tell me. What is it that you want that you can't let me go? What do you want? What? You contacted an influencer that has forced you to rebel against the sisterhood. And you ask me what I have against you. No matter what, he should not propel you to mess with a child. It took me nine months to have him. Whatever we have is between you and I, not with my husband, not with my child. You're wrong, Nancy. Everyone around you is strictly involved. Especially that young man, Michael. Whom I notice is the brain behind all these. He's directly involved. And I must get him. You lie. I 
dare you to touch that man. I dare you to touch my husband. You know you can't harm Michael, right? He is under my hidden power and protection. You can't touch him. And what hidden powers are you referring to? The one I've already taken away from you or any other one. You have hidden powers. Yet, you run mad on the streets. So you now think you're okay. Because the doctor injected one or two injections to your system. <laughs> Wait for another round of madness. And this time, the whole world will see your nakedness. For the fact that you went so deep to acquire another power for the sisterhood proves you have it planned out long ago. This is betrayal of the highest order. Now, give me one good reason why I should forgive you and spare the people you love. I am not begging you. I am taking it because it rightfully belongs to me. I am having my freedom. Listen, if you're scared I'm going to utter a word of this fraternity to anyone, then you don't have to be scared because I wouldn't even say a word. Your secrets are safe with me. Just let me go. Please. You have done that already. Then what else is left to bargain for? Huh? Oh! We can still strike a bargain. I get rid of the man that has known about us. And also get rid of the child. Third, your freedom is guaranteed. You are not only spiritually mad, you are about to go physically insane. You are not! How dare you! Listen! I am taking my child away from this place right now. And if you dare to stop me, I <laughs> will strike. What's up, baby? Why would they even want to mess with a child? Why? It's just a 
baby is just a child. Come on. Why? Why would you do that? Why? Why? Does not make any sense to me. What's our child? Huh? Um... I did. I'm not going to hurt our child. I, I need to know! What is going on? No, oh, they, they're not going to hurt our child. I mean, they've not hurt him, but... But what? They've refused to release him. They refused to release him. No! No! That is not right! This is unacceptable! No! Baby! <laughs> it's all right. It's not acceptable. This is our child. Do you get me? Yeah. Our child. Our baby. Come on. It's our child. We have to do something. Okay. I have to do something. We have to do something. Okay. Yesterday. And you have not gone to see her? Well, I have gone to see her. And what did she say? She would always want to play tough as usual. Nancy, do you want the truth? The fact is that what happened to you should have taught you a serious lesson. We all saw you hovering around the streets as a mad person, even with your pregnancy. I guess that's the price you pay for betraying the sisterhood. What in the world makes you think that you ever go scot-free? Okay, huh? okay, please calm down. Please. Nancy, you need to go and see her. Else she will kill your baby. Of course. <laughs> Don't you think she deserves it? Listen. Funke or whatever they call you stupid name, I do not care. I did not come here to battle west with you girls. I came to make something very clear. Your goddess or whatever you call her. Make sure you take this word back to your goddess. Not even a strike of my baby's head should be touched. If you guys dare come near me or my family again, I will destroy all of you. 
read my lips. I am not joking. Destroy us? What do you mean by that? Well, I know every secret of this fraternity even before what of you were initiated. Just a snap of my finger and you guys will be down. Stay the hell away from my family and do not try to touch my child. I am warning you, I will destroy you guys. I'm not joking. Is that a threat, Nancy? Are you threatening us? Can you believe that? Otiya will be. She's just mad. Please forgive me for, for coming here without my wife's consent. It is because things are out of hand now. Even Nancy does not have control over what is happening to her. I don't know what to do. We are confused. Yet she keeps insisting that I don't bring you into the picture. But how? We need help. Of course. You have done the right thing, son. My daughter belonging to a cult. What? What would have prepared her into this? How did he have the slightest knowledge about it? Not at all. Are you aware of it? Aduko has always been a good child to us. A child we are so much proud of. But who could have believed she belonged to such a deadly and devilish fraternity? We are not to judge her. You know, these things happen. I can tell you for certain that she did not even know what she was getting herself into when she joined that cult. She did not know that it was going to come to this. She's been a part of that cult since her first year in the university. Okay. Hey, We need help. That is why I'm here. We need help. We need to set her free from that cult. We need our baby back. Nancy and the baby are my life. They're my world. I can't live my life without them. They, they mean everything to me. We need help. We need help desperately, Papa. That, that is why I'm here. Please. Ask Adugo to see me. Both of you have to be here before the weekend. Is that understood? Yes. yes. Are we talking about the new baby your sister just lived that few days ago? <laughs> yes, now, we was saying that. But some people are really heartless. How could someone kidnap such a newborn baby all because of money? Or is it because the couples are wealthy? Chukwe, Ekene, we need make Are you deaf? Did I say kidnap? I say that the baby vanished. Yes! My in law said that the baby vanished before his very eyes. Hey! Is the Oko that powerful? Ha! You know, Oko. You haven't even had anything yet. See, my in law said that my sister is very powerful. That she is very powerful beyond the physical. And I always have feeling that my sister. That girl, if eh? she's a very strong girl, a very powerful girl. But Chidi, Uzo, 
This is more of a mystical mumbo jumbo whatever. As for me, I don't believe in such nonsense. Look at it. But you know what? What's the name of the monster called Jumbo Jumbo? Does it change anything? Because can it fair? Talk about that thing. Monster called Jumbo Jumbo Jumbo. So, what are they planning to do about the missing baby? It's a serious case, you know. Huh, my dear, it is. Oh, it's a very serious one. But I trust my father's credibility now. Do you know what I will do? Ha! My father is a very tough man. A very powerful. Have you forgotten? My family we are very tough now. Ah! Hey, look at, look at, tough man. Ah. What does that mean? Can't tell you, ta, tough man. I don't understand. Eh? Hmm. But wait, now. Ha! You can't obey the kids. Sweetheart, stop crying now, please. I was just doing the best that I can to, to get our baby back and put an end to all of this. Either you thought, or rather you think taking this news to my parents will help you achieve that, oh, right? I don't like it. How could you, babe? I trusted you. I confided in you. You are my husband. I know. But can you look at this differently? My darling, I love you. You know that I love you so much. I did not do anything intentionally to really call you. What I did is in our best interest. <laughs> this is a critical period for us. There is no way we're going to go through all of this without your parents hearing about it. Would you prefer if they had heard it from a third party? No, that would be good. Do we need help right now? Yes. So I decided to bring them into the picture so that they can give us the much needed help that we need right now. There are things that they know we can do to have our child back. They would help. That's all I was doing. Without my consent. Without my consent. That's why I went wrong. I'm sorry. I should have told you. I'm sorry. It was out of desperation. It was just me looking for ways, you know, to put an end to all of this. Look at you, you're always crying. It doesn't make me happy. I want her baby back. I want you happy too. So that. Sorry, forgive me, eh? so that we can move forward. Huh? Please. Hmm? Obim, be good. Eh? My darling, I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry. And now that um, we're here, I am thinking that we travel to the village first thing tomorrow. Yes, I would like for us to have a sit down with your dad. And listen to him. He might just have a few ideas that can help us out of this situation. Whose order did you shot the baby? My lady. 
that baby deserves the punishment. And who ordered you to do that? I'm sorry, my lady. Nancy has caused so much pain to this sisterhood. At least, this is a great start. You must pay for acting without instruction. It's a promise. Who did you say that told you this? Uzochi, Mazi Bekwe's son. I see. I always know that there's there is something fishing about that girl. I mean, the way she made such amount of money and controls it. And the strange attitude she displays. Me too, Papa. I know that there is no how such a single young girl could have made so much money. No, 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 no. Go down, go, go down, because this is night. So much money, without anything attached to it. And I think that the brother knows something about this. You should have seen the way he talks about the sister's involvement with the occult. Uh, even the father too. He must somehow be proud of the daughter. It's just like them. Okay, just like them. No wonder he didn't he didn't mention it to me today. Even I was with him this evening. He did not mention that. He just acting like everything is alright. I fear for my friend Ibekwe. He may lose the daughter and the grandchild in this exercise secret court is dangerous hey Kenny, are you sure about what you are saying yes and <laughs> since then i've been thinking about mysteries of life a newborn baby just got missing like that. <sighs> yes, of course. And I pray they find the baby soon. This is a very sad news. Indeed. Very, very sad. I just hope that they will see the baby. I hope so too. <laughs> the news has gone viral. Sure. There is nothing hidden anymore. The child is missing. Even the nurses confirmed it. I don't want to say what I don't know. But if really the child got missing in the hospital, that means there's something wrong somewhere. And I don't want to say anything, so I don't get missing. Let me just keep my mouth shut. You're always afraid. I have to. There are powers in this world. If a woman can give birth to a child in the hospital and the child goes missing, you don't know you two, you can just vamos. So forbid. Okay, just wait. miss, miss. My daughter, if I must help out, then you need to tell me everything about your occult, your involvement, and how it all started. It all started when I went to the city to visit Auntie Carol. Carolina, my sister? Yes, Mama. Legas, precisely. Does it mean 
She was the one that initiated you into it. No, Mama. It was her husband's younger sister, Nelly. When I got to the city, she got an admission into Lagos State University. I was left to be taking care of John, Auntie Carol's first son. So on a fateful day, I was playing with a child. Auntie, uh -huh. you're back. I'm back. Home. Welcome. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm fine. Hey, uh, hey what's that you're looking at again? Auntie, I do agree. I do go. What a beautiful name. Uh, thank you. And I think I prefer calling you by that name. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. I have something for you. Do you want it? Auntie Alfie. Hey, I love her. Thank you. Hey. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Thank you. Mm. It's very sweet though. Hi, this is <laughs> Lagos Happy. How do you know it's Lagos Happy? Uh -uh. Hey, I'm stressed out of bed. It's very sweet. Auntie. Oh, Thank mm. you. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it seems very simple. Thank you. Auntie, I'm going to take it to you. I'm going to take it to you. Ah, that's very nice. Um, I want you something. Take it. Make sure you finish it now before you start your work. Huh? Thank you, Auntie. I'll, I'll eat it later. Eat it now. I don't want you to eat it later. Eat it now. Yeah? You know, Auntie might come back. I want you to share it with her. Just finish it. You like it? But well, I think it's going to be biscuit biscuit. I know. You know, it's a foreign biscuit. You like it. Lagos biscuit. No, not Lagos. Foreign. Okay, foreign. Okay. You like it. <laughs> and see, I like it. <laughs> I Thank told you. you. Just hurry and finish it. Yeah? Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Foreign biscuit. Let's keep on. You see the gift of the devil is so flash, so difficult to resist. At the beginning is so enticing, at the end of it you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey. If you don't know the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pain and worry. So where do I go now?
the hair girl. What is it you said you want to talk to me about? Um, I wanted to tell Auntie this morning, but she left. She left before I could wake up. I saw myself playing near a river with one girl. As if that was not enough. I, I even ate in the dream, Auntie. And what is wrong with the dream? It's just a normal dream. Now. Is that why you're keeping your face like that? Don't scared. <laughs> Auntie, see, my mother says such dream is not good. And in my house, if someone has this kind of dream, my father used to do something to cancel it too. Come on, Ada. Come on. That is village mentality. This is Lagos. And in Lagos here, people do have such dreams and nothing happens. Auntie, are you serious? I'm telling you. See, you make sure you don't bother Auntie with this nonsense. Mm -hmm. Or didn't you have fun? I did, but... But what? Why are you worried? I told you it's just a normal dream. Okay, you know what? Go inside and have a breakfast. Then take good care of the baby. I'm off to school. I'll get you something on my way back. Okay, okay. thank you. You'll be fine, yeah? Bye. 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 See ya. It continued until I got my own admission. That was when Nelly came to take me to the goddess and I was properly initiated. Nellista, my humble daughter, go ahead and do the needful. Adugo, my beautiful daughter. Welcome to Goddess Sierra's kingdom. Step forward. Open your palms. Swallow it. You have bravely become a descendant of Goddess Sierra. Henceforth, you shall remain loyal and sacrificial to this altar. You shall receive orders from me and them accordingly. And in return, Goddess Sierra will reward you with wealth immeasurable and anything you ever desire. Everything that has happened here today, you must keep to yourself. Any attempt to divulge attracts your death. Understood? Good. Nellista, my humble daughter, for fulfilling this role, you have atoned for your sins. And you have bought yourself another fruitful years ahead. The blessings of Goddess Sierra is upon you. Auntie, why did you do that? I like you. And I want you to be protected. 
everything that happened in there was real. From now on, you'll be attending meetings with me in physical. Since you've entered college, I'll be your anchor. But I have to remind you that any attempt to tell the secret to anyone attracts your death, just as you've been told. After then, I became a descendant of the goddess and I did all their beatings. I was even made the executioner. Until I met my husband and everything changed. I then realized that I needed a life. I asked for my freedom and they refused. They refused giving it to me. Why did you keep it from your parents? Okay. She told you that if you tell anyone that you will die. But that's how young girls are getting initiated into evil cultism today. Look at how Nelly ended her life mysteriously. Well, I'm happy that what you need is freedom. And freedom you will get. As your father, I can assure you that you will not only be free, but you get your child back. I'll bring him here immediately. back from school. Hey. Oh, Ikini. I have told this several to stop asking me about my sister. When you see her on the road, you will not stop and talk to her. But when she goes back to school, you come and be disturbing my life. Dear Ikini, leave me alone. The truth is, I want to start chatting with her before I meet her face to face. She's too beautiful. And you see, that her cat's eyes would not let me look her straight to the eyes and talk to her. Hey! Ekene, mm -hmm. say her, stop her, get her number. It would be a very shameful thing that you could not stop a woman on the road and look at her face, Ekene. Why are you then a man? Why are you then a man if you cannot talk to a woman? Hey! Okay, no problem. When next she come, I will come over to the house. <laughs> I know you will not even have the guts to do that. But if you do, eh, I wish you all the best. Oh, come. Let me greet her, yeah? Ah, 
Yeah. <laughs> I chose the great. <laughs> Some unsycumcised persons want to take her life. I know everything about this. Do not panic. I shall handle it. There's nothing to worry about. But tomorrow morning, first thing, you must be in my shine. Allow me to rest. Uloma is my elder sister. He's always disturbing me to give him Uloma's number. What for now? He wants a girlfriend and doesn't know how to toast a woman. But I thought the Kene is too agile for some things. Why will he be doing something like that to a girl like Uloma? Do I know? But seriously, some guys are like that. I've seen most of them. In this village? Why do you want to know? <laughs> Hey, because you've not crossed this village to the city before. <laughs> Do I have your time? <laughs> village girl. Beautiful local champion. I have broken up every possible link to this fraternity. Now you tell me, why are you still stalking me? Why? Why can't you let me go? <laughs> Adugo, you amuse me. What link have you broken? You cannot break away from us. You're part of this sisterhood forever. You lie. You are nothing but a fatal liar. I have broken every link which I have with you. Why are you so stubborn? You are just unnecessarily stubborn. Let me go! Young lady, get your facts right. How can you say you've broken away from us when your soul still lies with Goddess Sierra? <laughs> My soul. What are you talking about? You will not understand. I thought you knew everything. Why are you ignorant of this? <laughs> See the gift of the devil is so flashy. So difficult to resist At the beginning is so enticing But at the end of it you'll be in bondage You are gonna have a sleepless night Scary day hey. And your night will be full of nightmares You are now What could she possibly mean by that? Hey. Hey. Wait a minute, the box? And worries, so where do I go now? Oh, you can get better than you. They got the need for me, oh my more. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, oh, you can get better than you. Oh, you can get better than you. If I'm alone, my more. Hey, Mazima. I was just coming to your place. My place? Of course. Is everything all right? That's what I'm coming to ask you. Are we no longer friends? We're friends. Why are you hiding such a serious matter from me? Even when you have resolved not to tell anyone, am I included? What exactly are you saying? You know what I'm talking about. I mean, the issue concerning your daughter. Eh? 
don't you think I might be of help How? to you? How? And who told you that? Uh, you, are th you think that it's a secret, but it's no longer a secret. The news is all over the village. What do you mean by all over the village? Your son told some people, and the people he shared with went around the village and spread it. My son. My son. Who's a chuku? Eh eh, my own son. Uh, Uzo Chuku, of course. I want to help you and put an end to it. And are we not friends? I mean, are we no longer friends? Let's put our heads together and set your daughter and the son free. This case is not as simple as you see it. Too. You are right. I'm already doing something about it. Uh, but I appreciate your concern. Okay. I will see you tomorrow. Not know how to tame his tongue. Eh? You see that tongue? I will cut it today. That tongue must hit the floor today. Nay. What happened? What are you talking about? I am already weeping in advance for your son. Because I will kill him today. He must die today! Nay, you have to take it easy. We are not murderers. No one is killing anyone in this house, Mban. Ah. See, you have to go into the house. Because sympathizers are coming. Because the villagers are coming to mourn your son with you today. Chukwu Aju. Uzo Chukwu is a dead man. Ndai, I don't like the way you are sounding. KD4, I don't like it at all. Every time, kill, die, kill, die. Nobody's dying. What happened? Look, could you believe it? That Uzochi has taken Adugo's issue out to the village. What? Yes, everybody knows about it. In fact, as I was returning, everywhere I go, they'll be asking me about the same issue. What is good about Simo? Hey, Mama! What is good about you? Nine, have to calm down. Nine, Bamba, it's okay. It's okay. We have a very serious problem at hand. Yes, our daughter is missing. Adugo is missing. What happened? How? She left here very early in the morning without telling anyone where she was going to. Up till now, she's not back. Even the husband that has gone to look for her has not been seen. It's so good. So, leave us or Chukwe alone. Get up the devil. It comes with so much pain and worries. So, where do I go now? Onye kange besala no. They go dini femero mwemo. Look what I've done to myself. Hey. Onye kamya kosala no. Onye kange besala no. If a man or a boy, you see the gift of the devil is so flash, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so. Allow me to take you to the hospital. This, this is serious. Please. Be listen. There wouldn't be any need if you taking me to the hospital. I mean, this is spiritual. It's, it's not something medics can solve. Trust me. Adhoma, are you ready to talk to us? 
and tell us what happened. Where are you going? Mama, I went to the river. I went in search of a box. A box? What kind of box? There is something inside the box. Something very special and I need it. I need my baby as well. I miss my child. I feel something has befallen him. And we need to do something. why I have come to find you. I believe you can do something about it. Be in your house tomorrow. I will inquire some things from your daughter and I will take it from there. Thank you very much. Great to be here. happy family. All I ever wanted was for you to be happy. I didn't mean to put you through the stress. Believe me, it's not intentional. It can never hurt you intentionally. Do you know that?
the the DBA said that uh, Papa and I should um, allow him a few minutes with her. So we'll just uh, we'll just. Um, what you eat? Oh. I'm done with the cooking. Food. Ah, <laughs> uh, Mama, I'm fine. I'm I'm okay for now. Eh? I'm not hungry yet, but <sighs> once I feel the need to eat, I'll let you know. But you've not eaten since. I know. Huh. Get, get, get my clothes up. Ozo, I haven't seen him since I I came here. How is he? Uzo. That's Uzo. That useless thing that will not spend a moment in this house. The only time he comes to this house is when he wants to eat or take his bath. He spends all his time with his useless friends. If it was still the time for slave trade, I would have sold him off and used the money to purchase a dog. Because I know that dog would have served me better. <laughs> Mama, please, uh, it's, not, it's not a good time to laugh. <laughs> uh, however, I understand how you feel. Uh, you must also understand that Uzo Chuku is at a point in his life where he's still trying to find himself. You know, he's, he's at that age, but, you know, take it easy. Very soon he would find himself. You want to go? Mama, Lord, no, dear, and he will begin to act right. It's not a problem. Thank you, my son. Thank you, my son, for that. Eh? But help me. Help me and ask him why he always likes speaking ill of our child, our son. Eh? Was it not a few, few minutes ago that Uzo left this house for an errand I sent him? Oh, you sent him? Ah, ah. <laughs> okay. Just a few minutes ago. Sent him on an errand. Can you swear to it? I'm sure you do Useless facts. Ah, brother. Ah, good afternoon, sir. Ah, Uzo. Hello. Fine. How are you? I'm fine, sir. I have been here for quite a while. Oh, yes. I am Uzo Chuku. Um, I have just spoken to your father concerning you, and he has some... Uzo Chuku, your father has some... not so nice things to say about you. And from what I have heard, I'm not quite impressed. Papa, what did you tell him, Brother Michael? We need to buy some materials to perform a very important sacrifice. Uh, Ezedibia, I, I am here and I assure you that you will get everything that you want for the sacrifice. Everything. Very urgent. Very, very urgent. You will get it immediately. See, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are not even sure of the next moment. Hey. If you see, the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pains and worries. So where do I go now?
ันตัดตาลันตัดข้าเอาอย่างข้าข้าข้าข้าอีบันอีบันดุอีบันอีบันดุอีบันโอ้ยยังไงจะเด็กเด็กผู้พี่เขาเอาแล้วเด็กผู้มาสาวบ้านอยู่บ้านเจ้าเฮ้ยเฮ้ยโอ้โหเนี่ยมุมเอ้ยมันเนี่ยโอ้ยมันเนี่ยกูรู้โอ้ยมันเนี่ยกูรู้โอ้ยมันเนี่ยกูรู้ฮ่าฮ่าโอ้ยไปเลยเจ้าเจ้าชินาบินโอ้ชินาบินโอ้เจ้าชินิบุกาเบียโอ้ชินิบุกาเบียฮ่าไอเจ้าไอเจ้าไอเจ้า Why would you discuss our family affairs with outsiders? Mm. Hey, why would you do that? Sister, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. But Papa exaggerated the whole thing. Then how did it happen? Tell us. Mm, like I said, I am sorry. I'm done. Oh, um, it was my friends, my two friends, Chida and the Kenne. And they took the matter across. But you shouldn't have told them. Papa said, don't tell anyone. He warned us. I am so sorry. It was too late. I have already told them before Papa gave the warning. Those are two. Learn to bridle your tongue. You're no longer a boy. You're now a man. You have to be careful. So that everything that happens within your family, you, you take outside and you say you told just two friends. That's like telling the entire country. Because they have their friends as well. You tell one friend, that friend has another friend that they are loyal to, and then the circle continues. What is wrong with you? What can... That's not enough. Too many complaints about you, Lily. And it's not right. Please, eh? straighten up. Papa, what is it? Nay, no, you're not looking happy. Is everything all right? Acho is dead. He died in the river Nike. He underestimated those people. What? Oh, this is not good. This is not... So what am I going to do now?
Show your face. Isaga the Great. I thought you were inside your shrine. No. I went to pluck some herbs. Ibekwe, this one you came to visit me today. I hope all is well. Isaga the Great, all is not well. Mbana. Mm -hmm. My enemies have decided to take away my pride. The only thing that gives me joy in this world. <laughs> Mbano, they will not succeed as far as I'm alive. <laughs> Isaka, they have almost succeeded except you make haste. <laughs> I have to run to you because I know you are the only one who can help me stop them. You have come to the solution ground. Let's get to my shrine to tell me everything I need to know. Let's go. <laughs> Who are you to trespass on my territory? I have come to do my job. You stay away from me. What makes you believe I will allow you to do that? Better go back from where you're coming from. That girl deserves freedom. She's mine and mine forever. Anybody who tries to come in between will regret it. I'm warning you for the last time. Go back from where you're coming from. <laughs> No one threatens the Zaga, the great Divya. The man who has fought both spirits and humans. The man who has crossed seven seas and seven forests and returned with great power. No one dares the Zaga. I shall set Adugo free today and there is nothing anyone can do about it. Not even you. Oh, no, Bon voyage Bon This is more serious than we thought. Nay. When did you hear about his death? This afternoon. I even went to the shrine and confirmed it. Really? Okay. So, um, Papa, does it mean all hope is lost? Honestly, son, I'm so confused. Really? I must admit that. I don't know what else to do or where to go from here. Um, Papa, I want to say thank you for all your efforts and all that you have done for us. At least I'm happy my wife has recovered to a reasonable extent now. And we can go back to the city where we came from and continue to seek for help because I am positive. I do not believe that this is the end of it. I do not believe that we cannot find the solution to this. We can. We will begin to seek for help as soon as we get back to the city. And I'm positive we'll find something, right, sweetheart? My son, what kind of help do you think you can get from the city? You never know until you, until you seek. So I'm positive. If you say so, no problem. But we must continue to look around 
until we get solution. Exactly. All hope is not lost. We shall be well. Hmm. Wait, Uzo. You mean even Izaga could hmm. not defeat the Orcots? Ha, huh, the Orcots. Eh? They are very strong. They are powerful. They are Karaka. Hmm. So you mean Izaga and Atrim died while trying to challenge the goddess? Exactly. This was the same goddess my sister fought and defeated. Wait, your sister defeated the goddess? Uh -uh. Didn't I tell you guys? You didn't tell us so. Ah, didn't I tell that my sister fought with the goddess and she was able to defeat, uh, to defeat her? No. Ah, my sister, she fought with the goddess for hours. Ha! Not be small fight though. Hey! You need to see that day. Eh? They were exchanging powers. The sky was bringing fire. Boom! Boom! Everywhere. My sister fought and fought. They fought to, from six to six. And I appear when they change the power. Finally, my sister defeated her. But wait, why didn't your sister return back with a baby? And uh, this one, this goddess now is not the one that has the baby. The one that has the baby is in the city. And my sister has gone to the city to bring the baby. Have you ever baby and let them start exchanging for water go? Hey! Huh. This is your sister. She's powerful though. Hmm, very strong. Give me around the court. Hey, she's strong. And see here, that time, the fight. Hey! Fire! Boom! Boom! It's open. Hey! Hey! Because I was like, my sister, she now come. That girl is powerful. Ha! She's very powerful. Freedom! 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 I wanna be free! Freedom! Free! Hey, I know do I get no I wanna be free I need my freedom oh, It's been long I am in darkness I want my freedom This is not the life I want I want not today. Please, please, please. please. I, huh? I need my baby. I know. I miss my baby. Just driving me nuts. I know, baby. I miss our baby too. Okay? Look, we have to be strong, okay? Everything will be alright. We're going to come out of this. Right. I'm confident that we will come out of it. I, I don't know how it's going to happen, but we will come out of it. Okay. Stop crying. I know it's hard. I know it hurts. I know. So I can no longer share secrets in my own house. My enemies have implanted a spy in my house as my son. I must end it today. I must kill him! Nani. What happened again? <laughs> eh? Well, what happened this time? Teddy Femelun. Oh, good dear. You can't believe it. Anosi was asking me about the death of Izaga and Achum. He knows everything! This is serious. How did he find out? Who else? If not for your son that's the spy in my house. How could Uzochuku do something like that? On Apoala? No, nah, he cannot do it. He can't. That, that is what I will find out. That is what I will find out after killing him! Calm down, no. It's not like this. It's a book eh? Don't, don't tell me to calm down. I don't want to get you involved. Oh. Just leave me alone. Let him go wherever he has gone, and let him come back and meet me here. I'm waiting for him. Nah, eh, relax your mind. 
I don't want to get you involved. Just stay away. I'm waiting for him. Let him go to where he finds Christian. Ah, my brother, my brother. Come, what's good in there? Are you crazy? Hey, 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 Papa, get out. What are you? Eh, I'm back. You don't want to go. Oh, what? Nah, nah, it's okay now. Eh? Nah, nah, oh, 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 it's oh, 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 I will show Papa, you will show me. I will show you. Oh, no. Hey! Shut up! You can't move on! No, you can't move on! Hey! 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 Chom and Izaga did their best. But the only problem is that we underestimated the other people. <laughs> Maybe they were not strong as we thought. Eh? Talking about Achum and Izaga. And what is that supposed to mean? These two men were the strongest DBS that we had. In fact, they were the Strongest in the whole of this zone. Wait. You don't know any Dibia. Mm -hmm. You don't know Dibias. Tell me now. I'm waiting. Huh? Haven't you heard about uh, Great uh, Aseka of Umudim village? Oh. Huh? Oh. Oh. Yes, Aseka. Oh, oh. Why, why have I not thought about him since? I know him. That is what I am telling you, that two good heads are better than one. You are right there. You are my good friend. Mm. You kept all these things away from me. If I have been involved from the beginning, all these things wouldn't happen. But, Go to Aseka. If you want me to accompany you, I can do that. No, 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 no. See, I know how to get to him. You have done the one big thing by reminding me of him. Hmm? Leave the other one to me. I know what to do. Okay. Now, uh, as a friend, move immediately. If you go there, all these things will be a thing of past. Okay. Try. See, the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night. Scary day. Hey. In your night will be full of nightmares You are not a show of the next moment Hey, If you know what I will listen The gift of the devil It comes with so much pains and worries So where do I go? Papa! My daughter, my father, 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 my father
In your night will be full of nightmares You will now take me show of the next moment Hey, If you look in the pencil With this if you will listen hey, The gift of the devil It comes with so much pain and worries So where do I go now? Onye kange besala no De go dini femero mwe mo my daughter, yes, Papa. Now, how are things in the city? Papa, we are managing, you know. <laughs> you say managing? No, 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 no. You are doing extremely fine. Uh -huh. eh? <laughs> you have even changed to your car. Is it not to your car? Eh? <laughs> Papa, how many cars do you even think I have? I have nothing less than five cars packed in my garage. It's just that I've been looking for a driver, but for now I have to be driving myself. People planning to bring like one or two cars for you down here to be really stressed. <laughs> so when you see your age, you might go to nine. He's so much very good. <laughs> now, my daughter. <laughs> So you are talking of managing, <laughs> eh? Mm. My daughter, you really tell me you are working in a car company, ha. eh? No, Papa, I'm still working in the same place. It's just that I got promoted and my salary doubled. <laughs> I thank God for everything. I thank God for everything. <laughs> thank God. <laughs> <laughs> and you call it managing. <laughs> no, you are doing great. Okay, Papa, I admit, I'm doing good. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. So, how are you people doing down here in the village? Uh, my daughter, uh -huh. uh, we okay, no problem. But the only problem we have uh -huh. is um, Adugo, uh, Ibeque's daughter, my friend. Uh -huh. uh, what? What kind of problem is that? You know, children of these days, I mean, children of nowadays, I don't know how she got herself involved in a, a cult. Eh? Adugo? Yes. Is she an occultic member? Uh, yes. The problem now is she wants to come out, but they won't let her come out of that uh, court. They even took her son, her son. She just gave birth to eh? And uh, uh, um, it's not possible. So, Papa, what are you people, the king's men, doing to help the situation? Um, my daughter, in fact, nothing. Uh, but we hope, we hope that it will be fine. No, Gadema. <laughs> See, I have been searching for you for, since I came back to this village. I swear to God. Searching for me? I swear. Where? Hey, all over. In fact, I took risk and I sneaked to the market. In fact, to your mother's shop. But lo and behold, I didn't see you. It's okay coming before God and So you don't know my house again? Your house? So are you expecting me to come to your house? When your mother will see me. In fact, the last time that I came to your house, I know how the thing was. Because your mother had been quoting Bible quotation for me. In fact, from Genesis to Revelation. In fact, all these things is still new in my brain. I haven't forgotten it. Nick, 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 please. The truth is that you should stop looking for me. Eh? I have other things, more important things that are bothering my head. Eh? I don't need a boyfriend. Huh? I want to go to the university, and you know what that means. Or are you ready to put the bill? 
that one is not a problem. Look at me. Now maybe Niki Niki. In Aota, see Niki in who you're in this village. See, as long as you make yourself available to me, I am. Mm. <laughs> see, I'm ready to do anything for you. I swear to God, who made me front and back. <laughs> no problem. Uh, you just have to pay my acceptance fee. Uh, it's just 120,000. Uh, okay? <laughs> After you pay it, then you can have it to yourself. Okay. Mugo? Okay. Mm. <laughs> uh, uh, 120,000. Yes, uh, my uh, only? Only. Okay. Uh, uh, you will be going now. Mm. Uh, we will talk later. I should go. Uh, we will talk, uh, we'll talk later. Mm. Uh, One hundred and twenty thousand naira. For what now? I shall make ban. In fact, one plot of land here in our village here is sixty thousand naira. So one twenty is two plots. Oka kwa mama ngora na. Yeah, bano. Ha. Hmm. Ah, ho. Maya rap to kome. Onye ba kuto onye nala. Fear not, my friend. I shall handle it. Of course, I trust you, Asika. But I must bring to your notice that these people are very powerful. They have killed two DBs already. <laughs> I said it, Bekwe, fear not. No, Kunku, Anna Koka, go Makanofu, go on. There is no cause for alarm. I shall handle them. Thank you. Azika the Great, I believe you. I trust in you. Uzo, Kehwan. What do you mean? You are in town? Oh yes. <laughs> when did you arrive? Well, I came in last night. Mm. I was even planning to come see your parents, yeah. but. I can see you're looking good. <laughs> and I hope that they're also doing good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. We thank God, though. And they are all good. Uh, even you, too. Look at how beautiful you look, eh? Uh -huh. Look at how charming. They can ignore Kaji man. Uh-uh. What's <laughs> up? Come on. I know you won't stop being crazy. Mm -hmm. Anyway, thanks for the compliment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, how is our Dugu? I heard about her case. How is it going? Oh, your father told you. Um, yes. I heard about the native doctors that try to help. Uh, so, also, what is your father going to do about the case? Oh. I don't know. I don't know anything at all. Come Where on, do also, Don't say that. Have you forgotten how close we are? <laughs> Have you forgotten our relationship? Come on, talk to me. Talk to me. Uh, um, Kate, yeah. um, this is a secret though. Secret? Yes. Okay, uh, my father is planning to go and meet Azika. Azika and the great Tibia from Umudim. Imanian, you know him? Yes. Uh -huh. So, and you know he's someone that is reputable for cases like this. Now, Umu I will believe it. No, Chan Chan, Pium, Obu. Um. Okay, that, uh -huh. that's fine. Uh -huh. I I hope it turns out positive. Ah, we pray. We pray it does. Eh? We hope so too. Um, Uzo, where are you going to? Okay, I'm going to. Uh... Don't worry, come in, let me give you a ride. Yeah. <laughs> yes, come in. <laughs> See the gift of the devil is so flash, so difficult to resist. At the beginning is so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night. Scary day. Hey, 
your nights will be full of nightmares You are now taking show of the next moment Hey if you look in the quince, what do you see? Pia, what do you see? Eh, Nick Chipul, hope that she they has been trying everything possible to get her, but he could not. But she keeps withdrawing money from him. Yeah, she keeps collecting money. Mamma, mamma, that's what we are going for. Hehe, nande wegi yo. Don't you know? That hope is like best ninja uh -huh. and Baba Ijebu. Uh -huh. Once you put your money in it, mm, she's gone. Uh -huh. Even that small Amara that you are looking at, uh -huh. just get close and see. You know, the best thing for us to do uh -huh. is to import girls from other communities. See, in fact, I, 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 I agree with you. Do you know what? Do you? Hope came to me face to face, uh -huh. eyeball to eyeball, uh -huh. and told me, Mick, that I should give her 120,000 naira for, for school fees, mm, admission fee. Well, 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 Can you imagine? I'm Muslim, I'm Yego. Yeah? Can you imagine? Hey. Can you imagine? Hey. No. Yeah, well, office, so. yeah. <laughs> yeah, nah. yeah? That is because you are now a father. Oh, oh, oh. Sarah, what? <laughs> look at you. Father, you father, look at this one. Say, father, me and you, which one is father? Your father ain't more than me now. See, let me tell you. I, I, I heard that their family is doing well. Mm. Yes, Elisa is doing well now. Mm. The last time that she came to the village, mm. she came with a beautiful car. Wonderful mm. car, eh? Mm. And her mother told her to sell it. Is it good? Yeah. Her mother told her to sell it. Eh, 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 and say Anka. That's better now. Yeah. It's better. Oh, but your point can't you can know? Yeah. So, if you count 120,000, yeah. she, mm. she will collect. <laughs> she will collect and call you Mogo. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Me, Mbano, or your meme? Where? She will now, mm. but she has not seen anything yet. Ah. Uh, see, let me tell you, guys, let mm. me tell you. Hope is just like this. Uh, Take him. In fact, I have original plan for her. Uh, I'm going to prepare myself. Uh, get ready. Uh, and one of these days, I have to invite you to my house. And when I invite you, eh, do you know what? I will open my window for you so that you will be peep. Eh? And watch the original and undiluted blue film. Eh? Oh no, if you no, he will come, he will come, he will come. You know, even no, 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 child will not turn out the same. No, 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 no. That what you just said is better than that. Even my lady spiritual, this man that I know is a very strong debia. If nothing is done, sincerely, I fear for the worst. Yes. Azika. I know him. Did you say these people have gone to solicit for his help? Yes, my lady. I see. Do not worry. I shall see to it. I've been wanting to tell you something. No? That is that you need to be very careful. You need to be very, very careful because your name is spread around the town. <laughs> if you want to obtain money from a guy, not people like Nick. Nick and Nick. Does Nick, does Nick has money? Nick or Diego? Eh? See, I know Nick does not have money. That's why I asked him for that amount. So that he will leave me alone. The guy has been disturbing me all around this village. <laughs> 
So he had the guts to gossip on my name. Who so bad you Who see in this village? Who know who is who? No, no, who? Ah. Biko, I did not tell you anything, no. Hmm? Don't tell him I told you anything. I am just telling you so that you be very careful. Some kind of people you talk with. Eh, hey, I've heard you, but in this village, in this village, you know. This is yeah. be asking you this, Azika. Why are you trying to get yourself involved in my business? One well, of my daughters needs her freedom. Don't you think she deserves it? No, she doesn't. She's my daughter. And I decide whether she gets her freedom or not. You better stay away from this. You know, you have no such right on me. Sierra. A little girl you initiated against her will. I manipulated all these years. She has offered you a lot and you have used her enough. What do you still need from her? Sierra, and what right do you even have to take her child from her? This is your mode of oppression. And you describe it. Sierra! There is no written successive pattern in doing this in the spiritual realm. But there are rules you must observe in the spiritual realm. Do you really want to cross this circle with me? Azika, we are both masters in what we do. And we cannot afford to clash with each other. Azika, let's strike a baggy. He refused to tell me. But it seems like he has been compromised. How do you mean he has been compromised? I don't understand. It looks like they found out he was involved and they intervened. No, Nai. There is no way they could have found out. I mean, who could have told them? <laughs> it's not true. Bia, who's Ochi? Who did you tell? Me. Ah, I did not say anything to anybody. You think I believe you? When your mouth runs like a, a tap that is uncontrollable. Come on, Nai. Eh? He is no longer a kid. He cannot do that. I mean, there is no way he could discuss such secrets to anyone. No way. I'm not even after learning his lessons from the previous mistakes. So, did he tell you that he has learned any lessons? Of course, Papa. I have. I, I do not... I do not tell anybody anything. You better be sure you didn't say anything. Because this time, I am going to poison you and nothing will stop me. Useless boy. Look! Listen. I know you told somebody. I'm very sure you told somebody. But I will poison you. I will kill you in this house. Uh, Papa Makachi. Mm. 
I did not tell anybody anything. I, I was moon no Obama. Mama. Mama. Nonsense. Come. What's it? Are you sure you did not tell anyone? Mama, Makachi, I did not discuss with anybody. I was moon no Obama. I know why I'm asking you. Because I know how your tongue works. If I find out that you told someone, Makachuku, I will kill you myself before your father. Olu. Yes. Ekene. Mm -hmm. My father is not happy. Mm. And I think all hope is lost. But wait, do you mean native doctors can take bribe? Oh, you are now. That's what it looks like. Because for my father to come back and say it, it means something is wrong somewhere. And I don't think there is another hope. All hope is not lost. Just be prayerful. I need it, man. We are praying. Talking to me? Huh? It is you I'm talking to. It is you. What will you do? Who? Eh? You have been disturbing me on a daily basis. I told you I'm not interested, but you will not listen, promising me heaven and heads. Come 120,000 that I asked you for my acceptance fee. You could not provide it. Rather, you started spreading my name around this village. Go punish me. Come and touch me now. Come and touch me. Please, please, don't, don't, don't be sad. I, I'm ready to bury you on the ground. She's a woman. You want to fight with a woman? Come down. See, let me tell you. Let me tell you. One day is one day. Huh? Very soon, this Nick will hammer. You will bend down like this. Hey. Huh? And be telling me, Nico, please come and accept me. Make sure you get there. If you know you go to your mother's room, that's where, maybe that's when you are. Look at this mosquito! You don't get Nick! Everything you don't work! You are worn out! You can I see this? I'm still passing! I'm Look at this mosquito! I'm breastfeeding my breast! Go back to your mother's room and suck breast! You need your mother's breast! You don't take breast! I can't hear you! Your breast is breast milk! Look at you! You have the people breast! Your breast is breast milk! 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 Your breast is breast Did you fight with anyone? Why is your face like this? Mama, it's nothing. Amara, what happened? Mama, is that boy called Nick? He almost beat up this boy along the road. <laughs> the same boy you were complaining about? Yes, Mama. Uh, don't worry, Mama. You, you will meet his match in this village. Boy. Don't, don't tell me not to worry. Because I'm going to warn him seriously. If he touches my daughter in this village, I will not take it lightly. Um, I will not. Um, I'm going to take it seriously. Um, Nancy. How is the move to secure your freedom going? Why do you ask? I want to be free. Likewise, most of us in there. Nancy, we also want our freedom. But the thing is that we, we are waiting for you to secure yours. Then we know how to go about it. You know what we are living now is not life. And it's hell in there. I, I need your help. 
You've not really helped yourself. Listen, Lizzy, I... No, I... no, 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 no. Nancy, please. You don't tell me nothing. You were the one that inducted me into this fraternity. And right now, I want my freedom. The thing is that I don't want to lose my life while on it. So please, you have to do something. You don't get it, do you? I and my family, we've been going to hell. My husband and I, we've gone through a whole lot and at this point, we are confused. Every native doctor we've got to for this particular thing has lost their life along the line. I don't know what is going on. Listen, the goddess or whatever she calls herself, she is more superior. She's even stronger than we thought, than I thought. The fact that my baby is still there is driving me nuts. I don't eat anymore. I don't take care of myself anymore. I don't even have time for my husband. We've totally lost it. Did you say your baby? Yes, my child. My child has been there. And you think your child is still there? They killed my baby. Nancy, you of all people should know better. I mean, you have great power more than most of us that knows nothing about the sisterhood. Well, I, I heard that your baby... Oh, okay. I I will be with you shortly. Please hold on. All right. Okay. Um, that's it. I will have to see you some other time. I have to go now. If you are still fighting for your freedom, I wish you the best of luck. But if you're talking about your baby, I'm sorry. I am honestly sorry. See the gift of the devil is so flashy, so difficult to resist. At the beginning is so enticing, but at the end of it you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night, scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares You are now taking show of the next moment Hey, If you don't know what to do With this if you will see The gift of the devil It comes with so much pains and worries So where do you I... Anywhere I see him in this village I will insult him till he beats me up See, I will advise you If you listen to me yo. Eh? I would advise you to just let go. Eh? Because no matured man go about the village gossiping a girl. Just let go. At least now you are free from his toast. Toast. Does that one even know how to toast a woman? Please, 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 let's walk fast. I don't want to talk about all these boys that are not fully circumcised. What do you mean? When you get to a level, you will understand. Yeah. <laughs> hey, not here. I will not hear in this situation. So you have a level. <laughs> There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Oh, to break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain. Oh, to break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain. Oh, there is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Do you know there is power? Yes, yeah, so what is this about? Our church program. What is your name? I'm not here to tell anybody my name. Rather, I'm here to preach about the name that is above every other name. And what name? What name is that? 
Jesus Christ. I hope that this is your Jesus who solve the problems that I have in my life right now. Of course it is. <laughs> uh, are you sure? Yes. Oh, haven't you heard about Jesus before? Of course I've heard about the name Jesus Christ. A lot of people use it for a lot of dubious reasons to enrich themselves. They throw it around. It almost... Look. I... Brother, please allow God to be the judge. Okay, the tract I gave you, there's an address there. Go to the church or visit any living church. Be the pastor in charge. I believe God will give you solutions to your trouble. I'm a living witness. Trust me. By the way, my name is Sister Rose. Break everything, Break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain. Do you see the spirit of the Lord is moving? Oh, may God bless you, Michael and uh, Sister Nancy. You see, Christ is the answer you seek. You can't use darkness to get rid of darkness, and you need light to illuminate the darkness. Christ is the light you need in your lives. But, before we embark into any of these, you have to give your life to Christ. Accept Him as your personal Lord and Savior. According to the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17, all things are passed away, and behold, all things are new. You see, when you give your life to Christ, you become a new creature. And Jesus Christ will save you after confessing your sins, according to Romans chapter 10, verses 9. Um, thank you, Holy Spirit. That's Kabaski Is there anything you have on you that still connects you with them? Yes, uh, the, the ring. Yes, that ring. Place it on this desk. And you, Sister Nancy, I can see some power of darkness inside you. Yes, Pastor. I still have other powers in my system. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. You see, you initiated a lot of girls, just like the way they initiated you. But I want you to bring all of them so that they can be free from this evil bondage. Uh, Rise up, let's take the place of the Almighty. Let's take for his mess. Just bring it. Kadosh, 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 Adonai, Elohim, Tevaot, Holy, Thank you. Ah. Name my cantas him. 
Balango Shada. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. You are free in Jesus' name. Oh, uh, Michael, she's free. Yes, she's free in Jesus' name. There is power, there is power in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Hey. Do you know there is power? I know there hey. is power in the name of Jesus. In the name oh. of Jesus. To break every chain. Break every to chain. break every chain. Sisters. You talked about a box. What is inside the box? Um, Pastor, it's the strength of our hairs. It's locked with a padlock, and the padlock is kept inside the box. If that box is not opened, and the padlock opened too, we cannot and will not be free. Pastor, please, we need you to help us because we want to get married and be free. Exactly, Pastor. Every member of our group is ready to be free. Please, help us. Please. Thank you, Jesus. You see, first of all, you have to accept Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. You have to surrender all to Him. And uh, you will embark on 21 days fasting, 6 to 6, with some 35. <laughs> then we shall go for liberation. And the Almighty God will manifest His power in your lives in Jesus' name. Amen. So, sorry, Pastor. Did you say six to six for 21 days? Oh, yes. Six to six, 21 days. Let us write on our feet. Spirit of the Sovereign Lord. Come and make your presence known, reveal the glory of the living God. Let the weight of your glory cover us. Let the light of your river flow. Let the truth of your kingdom reign us let the weight of your glory let the weight of your glory fall father i pray for your children this morning there is power, there is power. in the name of jesus there is power in the name of Jesus. Where is the box? Um, Pastor, the, the box is there. <laughs> you are Yahweh. 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 Alpha and Omega.
your mouth right now and begin to call upon the name of the Lord. For the Bible says right from the death of John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered violence and only the violence take it by force. In the beginning was the world and the world was God. I take power and authority over you who form to our spirit. All you spirit of my kingdom of Peter in this river. I destroy you now by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ of So that the measure of the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, every shall bow. All you false spirit of the darkness, all you power of the Mary kingdom, I subdue you now. I come against you by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I destroy you now. I destroy you now. I destroy you now. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ of today, I command fire from above. I command fire from above. I command fire from above. This is from a fire in the future. This is from a fire in the future. This is from a fire in the future. Let who may touch your color. Let the touch your color. Destroy you by fire. Don't let it get a bow. When your children saw the Red Sea and they looked back, behold the chariot, they called upon you, Lord, and you answered them to change their thoughts. I destroy you now. All the power of the most I go. I command fire now. Amen. I destroy you by fire. Amen. Destroy you in Jesus' name. Amen. I destroy you with fire. Destroy by fire in Jesus' name. Amen. Destroy. And when Jezebel was after Elijah, Elijah challenged all the prophets of God at Mount Carmel. He called upon you, Lord, and you answered him because you are the Jehovah Jireh. Because you are the ancient of days. I call upon you, Lord. They say I would fire now and destroy the shackles of the command you to catch fire. Amen. They call to Baba Shanda Kanda Chikara. They get Baba Tanda Chala Chiko. Jehovah El Shaddai. Jehovah Yahweh. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Who can battle the Lord? In the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Oh, to break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain. To break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Shout of victory. Thank you, Jesus. Shout of victory. Thank you, Jesus. Shout of freedom. Congratulations, you are all free from shackles of darkness. You are the mighty man in battle.
Anointing the name of the Father. Amen. Anointing the name of the Son. Amen. Anointing the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Well with you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Father. Mother, come and carry your baby. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It's not be you. Tell me where for day today. dreams you are true. I decided to come and tell you all that I have been through ever since I got admission in that school. And I want to use this opportunity to advise the young ones never to be involved in anything that has to do with cultism, no matter how it is branded. My eyes have seen my ears. I am who wants him. You mean to tell me that Nancy and Kate are part of the circle? Yes, Mama. I am sorry. Please forgive me. I deviated from everything that you and Papa taught us. I'm sorry. But above all, Thank God Almighty for this freedom. My dear, we need to start fasting immediately so as to cross the devil totally. Hmm? But please, promise me one thing. Go back to God. Give yourself back to God. He's a merciful God. I will forgive you. He will take you back. He's my daughter. Mm. Just get up. No, I'm okay. sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. We have all sinned. Eh? <laughs> but we come short of the glory of God. But he's a merciful God. We can see that. Just get up. <laughs> oh. He did it for children of old. He will do it for us. Who has to see Nancy and Kate? So as to give them proper counseling. So what else can I do? Okay, Mama. I I will be going back soon. Because we will be meeting with the man of God first thing tomorrow morning. Okay. That's a good one. But we must have to go and give reverence to God. For this total freedom, I thank God. Because the Bible says, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego were thrown into the center of the flame. But God protected them. He will protect you. As far as you come out from your sins, confess it, denounce it, God will forgive you and take you back. He is a merciful God. Oh, he will do it for you. There is nothing too much for him to do. It's okay. I thank God for today. It's okay. Thank you. Now I can understand. My mother will always use Nancy and Kate to make reference to young girls that are doing well. And will always advise me, Amara 
to always look up to them. So this is it. Hey, Amara, when my mom told me all these things, I nearly fainted. Cause bumps all over my body, my own sister, into cultism. And she comes on pretending to be a saint. She comes without any form of makeup because my mom hates anything artificial. How could you have known that she was involved in cultism? <laughs> that is it. Mother should always look well before they use Yahoo boys ritualists to make reference to their children. Without knowing the source of their wealth, if you don't look closer, you will not see. Okay! As I am now, my mother has declared one week fasting, six to six daily. <laughs> That's what I'm doing now. That is better to keep the devil off. Eh? <laughs> Uh, let me go home uh, and eat. Uh. You need to pray and fast for your elder sister. She needs it. Amara. Amara, are you mocking me? No, it's not a mockery, my friend. Just pray and fast for your elder sister. Let me go and eat my food. Uh, it's not my elder sister that is a ritualist. Amara, I don't blame you. Don't worry. It's not your fault. I don't blame you. I, I don't blame you. Oh yeah, hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I wanna be free. Freedom, freedom. Hey, I know do I get no freedom. freedom. I wanna be free. I need my freedom. freedom, freedom. Oh, it's been long I am in darkness. I want my freedom. This is not the life I want. I want to be happy. I want to be free. So let me be. I don't need you anymore. No more darkness, I have seen the light The light of freedom hey, I wanna take a walk of freedom hey, I wanna be free hey, I know do I get no I wanna be free my freedom, freedom, freedom. Oh, it's been long I am in darkness. I want my freedom. Yes, Mama. What God cannot do does not exist. Eh? We are here now. Thank God. I really thank God. Were they members of your cult? Yes. And our own kids too? Yes, Papa. Apart from her, she's our new nanny. Now, can you all tell me what you have benefited from joining that old cult? Say it. Go ahead. We have all seen what Adugo went through trying to get her freedom. I don't know what on earth that young boys and girls want to benefit from fraternities and cultism. Look at all of them. Beautiful girls. You've all made up your mind not to get married and have offspring. Thank God for today. We have all learned our lessons. And we know that there is no power on earth or beneath that is greater than the supreme power of our Lord Jesus Christ. And I implore you all to have faith in Him. To put your trust in Him. 
so that your life can move forward. It is well with all of us. Amen. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, Uzo, um, cheers now. Let us just um, relax and settle down. Eh? You are all welcome. As <laughs> if I know you people are coming now. Let me bring something. I prepared something. Please, please. So much pain. You see, the gift of the devil is so flash, so difficult to resist. At the beginning, it's so enticing. At the end of it, you'll be in bondage. You are gonna have a sleepless night. Scary day. Hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey. If you know what the gift of the devil, it comes with so much pain and worries. So, where do I go now? Oh, you can get better They go in the infirmary. Look what I've done to myself. Hey, oh, you can get better you see the gift of the devil is so flashy so difficult to resist at the beginning is so enticing at the end of it you'll be in bondage you are gonna have a sleepless night scary day hey. And your night will be full of nightmares. You are now taking show of the next moment. Hey, if you're lonely, you're going to see.